Hello, hello. Are we anybody there? Shani is live. I'm pulling up the screen for you guys right now. We're getting right into it. Hope everybody's having a good day. It looks like she's going to be playing some games. Don't know how boring that's going to be, but we shall find out. Hell yeah, I have. That shit go. is amazing. I love how they, like, have that meat on these big, giant, like, swords, and it's, like, all round, up, and you everybody? just slice it, and you just, like, can eat to your heart's content and fill your whole gutty what's full of fucking meat. Like, tasty, juicy, amazing meat. Like, the best meat you'll ever freaking have. <laughs> that. Hi, Londov. Hi, Candy. That's what we're talking about. Hi, JR. Brazilian steak. Hi, Jamie. Man. Jacqueline. Ashley. Some like, idiot. You know. Chelsea. Right now, I'm doing this because I'm just Prime trying Hoover, to find Pacific some Northwest mixed seeds. Lolly, you know? Green Giant, Dinah. You're all here. Thank you for being here. You know, and you can collect the fiber. That's a good thing. It's collecting the fiber. You know. Hi, Pirate Hacker. But Mixed Hi, Sabrina. Seeds right now will be your Hi, friend. Hi, Kitten Hotel. Because you can plant them and have more plants. Hi, Scott. It's brilliant. It's a brilliant way how to go forward. It looks like there's some berry trees here. A little pond to go fishing. In. All right. This what is actually the first, about? first time I actually tried the Four Corners, actually. So... I'm not quite sure about the layout of this, but it, it looks pretty cool, actually. I think I like it. Oh, that's awesome, Ashley. I'm you so ha glad to hear that. It's really neat looking, actually, how it's laid out. You know? This is awesome. I like it. It's like space, it's spacious and everything. Got some sections with hard wood. You know, we're just taking our time and, and doing our own thing. Oh, pirate you know? hacker! I didn't. We don't have to like go. I'll like, have to go check those out. Hi, Lynn. On this game, man. I'm sorry, pirate hacker. I this actually just awesome got up a little while today. ago. Slept in late today. I'm always working on something something. I got a I got an empire to establish. <laughs> right, Londa? In my freaking world right Hi, now Tyra. in my life. And I'm trying to establish it. And you know, I'm doing it for Jesus to tell you the truth. Oh my god. You know, Jenny. and I'm praying to him and you know, I'm seeing I'm seeing what the power of prayer can do. Oh look at this. It's Grandpa's letter, loner. Wait for my return. Yo, the she's dog high. Of your third You can tell year. she's fucked up on something. Dude, what's he's up, gonna Whitney? Return like Jesus. That's awesome. Resurrection, bros. Anyway, um. Hi, Godshaw. I don't know yeah, what you're talking about. Yeah, I do everything. Hi, Thunderain. And I want to do Hi, it for my family. I want to make my sons proud. Then and get them back. I love, you know. Oh my God, she wants to make her sons proud by doing what? Playing games? That's basically it. That's not gonna make them proud, Shanny. Like, is she so, serious? We're gonna keep doing this. Getting all this like weeds all cleaned up and stuff. I Don't wonder how this is gonna look actually after one year. By barely going into town, because all your work will be on your farm and working on it, making it look good. And, Hi, little Miss Cindy. You know, Hi, Freddy. I am curious about that. Like, how's it gonna look? I can't believe I like she thinks that this is going to make her sons proud of her. definitely one of the bigger 
uh, of the choices you can make in your land. Like, this is huge. This is gonna be amazing for farming. Hi, Marion. Like, I could put my animals in this little section right here. Right? Right, Shaw? That's what I'm thinking. She like, sounds high. where Grandpa is. We'll put the animals where Grandpa is. You try really hard to be nice when people aren't nice. That's sweet. I try. Bitch, I no, try. You don't. I'm just. I'm learning to ignore it more. Right. Than of people. Sure um, you are. That can be challenging, though. Is is dealing with that and and just knowing that people are just. Hi, Sharky so depressed i don't know i'm thinking depression that causes people to act that way but they're so depressed that they can't realize that their actions affect others in a negative manner like totally bro it's and like totally they don't tubular. realize that people have feelings and you shouldn't act that way so yeah it's like, Totally. Do you counter it by telling them to, you know, fuck off all the time? This is awesome. What's up, Christy and Carl? How I are you guys doing? I can get my copper Hi, teddy bear. right now. Hope you're having a better day today, teddy bear. Hell yeah. That's awesome. Hi, Blue. Hi, Channel 69. Yeah, she sounds like she's really high, y'all. Yeah, Pirate Hacker. I do, too. Boom, I, the geode. I can't believe she's pointing out anyone else geode. being depressed when her and Reb were literally just, like, miserable a day or two ago. That's how you know it's money and, and drugs. Because Fuck. look how different her demeanor is now. I didn't think about this. And that's all that's changed. We're gonna changed. have to get some wood. We need 50 wood. Right, Rudolph? We were just saying that. You know what? This is already Hi, farmed out land. Hi, but I don't want to use it because my rocks grow there. Never mind. We're not doing that. That would be fucking dumb. That would be fucking dumb. Hmm. You can sit here and ruin a perfectly good game, oh guys. That. Don't you want to watch? Okay. So... Don't you want to watch me do everything but work to get my kids back, guys? I know what to do. Alright, so I guess we're going to have to do something. <laughs> Shannon is a stupid dork sometimes. I swear to God. We don't have to do it right now, though. We'll What's just up, bro guy? For right now. Hi, Kitten Hotel. That's what we'll do. We'll just continue emptying it out of weeds and 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 looking what's been going on, cause you know. God, she's so boring with this shit. We're doing that that way, you know. But that's awesome. You can get copper down there. Hi, All Marco. I need is twenty copper, and I can make myself a freaking furnace. That'd Why don't you awesome. make yourself a job, all Shani? All the geodes I'm going to get from all these rocks. That's what so you really need. I figured. Would it be that bad, actually? See, my thing is, if she can do shit like this, if she can stream and play these stupid games for hours and hours, she can yeah. work from home. She can answer the phone and call people and do some work from home. Born that wouldn't be that hard USA. for her. What's up, AJ? Born in the USA. Born in the USA. Thank you, Becky. You were born in the USA. 
and subscribe to me. Oh, Marco, that would Work be scary. Yes, and I love you. Let's be free. Because we were born in the U.S. What's up, six up? The motherfucking USA. Don't forget that. I forgot the words. Because we were born in the USA. Yeah. There we go. Bitch, shut the fuck up. Don't nobody want to hear you sing and ruin Bruce Springsteen. the Bruce famous Frank's YouTube thing. stars? Maybe. Possibly. Born in the, UFC, in the UFC. My fucking famous. Born in the KFC. I was addicted to KFC. Rev, check your PayPal. Don't let Shanny take it from you. Here you we go. To check it? Here we go. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Silas. It might Ledge. give you some motivation to want to do something. I feel very sick, honey. Oh my god. I know. He feels very sick, guys. So she must have done all the drugs without him. I know you do. Not faking. I feel ill. I know you do. Alright. I didn't say you were faking. Bitch. Born in the USA. Oh, please stop. I would just throw those things away. I guess. Ah! For as often as Rev says that he's sick, I think he's the one that's dying. And I think he's dying of dope sick. I think he's dying of drug withdrawal. Well, the mystery has been solved. Be right back. Oh, God. She's already taking a freaking break here. What's up, Misty? What's up, Ilana? What's up, Debbie? Did I miss anybody out? Lolly? How are you doing, Lolly D? Did I say hi to you, Dawn? Hope you're doing good. Hi, Errant Massa. How are you doing? She solved the mystery. What is the mystery, Shanny? Did you finally find out where your feet were after you hadn't seen them for so many years? <laughs> I'm being petty this morning. Hi, Ace Marie. Hi, Sherry. Hi, Anna Nicole. How are you guys doing? We're watching Shanny high as fuck play some video games. Not well. And Rev is sick. What's new? Oh, hi, Barbie girl. Hi, Supreme King Nick. Oh, God, yeah, they're live again and still not working. You know that. If she had a job, if they actually got a job, I think I would die of shock. Literally, I'd just, like, pass out. Uh -huh. <laughs> Diabetes. Look at those feet. I'm back. Hi, Undead Ramen. Hi, Spav. The mystery has been solved. I did do it the other night, Teddy Bear. And we <laughs> eleven. Uh, see, I can't do it when I'm not like. I have to do it whenever I hear him. Pretty much emptied the sound. Or house. else it sounds cheesy. <laughs> of all its weeds, wait. Hey, Trash Panda. Almost. Yeah, this is Shanny Live being boring, playing some video games. Dude, her hands look huge right now. Do y'all see that? Oh, you can't see it because of the screen. Hold up. Let me go like this. Nope. Do you guys see her hands? Look. Her hands look like giant hands. Yeah, they're streaming her. Now that we know who you are, sir. Uh-oh. They figured out who someone now was. Now that we know who you are... That's a big we old know hand. now that you are no friend of Rev's. You are his enemy. Uh oh. Looking for information. What do you know? So you can exploit it on your stupid fucking show. Oh. 
Who is it? You don't care about my husband. You use my husband. I think I know who they're talking about, guys. I think I know. Hi, Margie. It's somebody so that gone. Uh, it's somebody that Shani m mentioned the, the other band. day. Band. I'll tell you that much. It's somebody that she mentioned the other day. You don't take advantage of me or my husband. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And pretend you're something, someone that you're not by using a fake name. Mm. What do you know? What do you know? It's not drag. Now it's we not know. drag. <laughs> Drag's on vacation. Nope, not G-Man. Not G-Man. Oh, there's Clint. What's up, Clint? Thanks. See, that's the thing about the people that they're getting money from. Thanks. Especially, like, one in particular I know gives them money to try to get close with them. Thanks. And that's the whole thing. Like, the people that are doing this that give them they're not their friends it's nah, people it that matter. are just trying to get in good with them to get information that's all and you would think they would wise up to that but i think sometimes they're so desperate for money they don't he care has been dealted with hi taylor hi little bit been dealt with. He's been dealted. You smelt it, you dealt it. <laughs> you cannot fool me. What is wrong with me this morning? I'm like, I, I have my, my uh, humor is like that of a 12 year old or something. I don't know what's wrong with me. Excuse me for being a little immature this morning. You thought you could though. Ha! Ah. Yeah, I mean, people can say what they That's want about me and um, me talking to Shani for, for two weeks while Reb was in jail or whatever and being nice to her for that time period. But I was not doing that to troll her. Like, I, I actually felt bad for her for a very short period of time. But I also didn't lie about who I was I and I didn't ever me. give her a fucking dime. Like, I, I, I wasn't willing to pay her others. to uh, get close get to her, put it that way. I feel like Fuck I'm validated that. in some way, shape, or form by a bunch of enabling narcissists. What's up, Trina? What's up, Not Sure? How are you guys doing today? Sherry, he you did. think I care or intimidated by you? No, I am, do not care. Sherry, he was or in jail for 13 days. close That's to intimidated it. by you. So he, he served for a little while. No, why? Shaney didn't show up to court. Me so they hell. dropped it. And every little type of hell you put me through, I fucking survived. Sure, Shaney. What's so up, So you Pamela? can move on with your fucking life than using my husband and exploiting him for your fucking show by making it seem... Like I'm abusive or fucking controlling to him. You can Ooh. fuck the fuck off. <laughs> Hatfield McCoy, what's up? Hi, Tubian. We cannot be bought or sold. We're true believers. And you're a dumbass for thinking that. I'm trying to Period. say trying to say hi to everybody but if i miss you guys please forgive me sometimes i don't see every, every person but i never Damn try it. to ignore any of you guys so i really do make a point to try to be welcoming and I mean, say hi to everyone so hi rainbow pixie fuck yeah we'll get rid of the clay fuck that hi kit, kit no tell that's what i'm thinking there'll be plenty of time to get the clay but I'll let you guys decide. But this is important. Who you think it is. Hi, Panda. I can actually put shit in here. 
Um, Teddy Bear, did I ever feel she was trying to get money from me? Ironically, uh, no. That feels I didn't. Better. She never tried. She never asked or anything. But like I said, I literally talked to her for two weeks, so it wasn't like it was that, you know, long of a time period. Hi, Firefly. And she had gotten fifteen hundred dollars from the uncle. This shit and I barely have any fucking energy. Yay! We're doing it, folks. You're getting notifications. That's awesome. Um, Sherry, he doesn't. You think he we can water the whole thing without feigning? Let me turn her down for a minute so I can explain it. Since she's just talking about the game anyway. Um, Sherry, so he got arrested and served thirteen days in jail for the assault. You know. Um, and Shani, because Shani did not follow through <clears throat> and show up to the court uh, date, sluggers. they dropped the charges on uh -huh. him. I so, we can thank Shani for the fact that he never was held truly accountable for what he I did must. to that child. That was all Shani's fault, because she wanted him back. You'd buy a Bible from Rev if he became a wholesaler? That's awesome. But yeah, Teddy Bear, she didn't ask for me, any money from me because literally she got $1,500 from Rev's uncle and it was supposed to be to Rev, bail Rev out of jail but then she decided not to re bail him out of jail and just spent the money so for that two weeks she had money so she she might have hit me up for money had she not had that but she did have it and so yeah she never mentioned money or asking for money from me and I would have told her no if she did what's up Mick What's up, Mike? Or is it Mitch? Without a T. Mitch without a T? Hopefully I'm saying that right. Ah, it's raining. And awesome. there's another Mike. Hi, Mike. What's up, Light Being? You craving chicken fries from Burger King right now? Oh my god. Oh, Light Being. It originally was $500, um, and they got the 500 bucks to go to bail him out. Well, then when they called the jail... The price had changed, and it or the, not the jail, the bail bondman that they were going through. The that they had upped it to fifteen hundred dollars. So that's where why the the number changed. Is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pri Pierre's got you covered. Oh, thanks, Sherry. Stop I'm glad. by Pierre's General Store today and check out our affordable size twenty four backpacks. See you What's soon. up, Guido? Someone corrected me on your name the other day because I was saying Guido. I, I did not know that I was saying that wrong. It's Guido, right? Sorry for butchering that before. I think now I got it right for Oh, ya. my God. Oh, my God. I Mish. want one of those pre-made yogurt cups with fresh got fruit you. at Sam's Club. Oh. Got you, Mish. Thanks for telling me. You know, it's got a I'm really bad at good pronouncing yogurt names sometimes. parfait. McDonald's. Mm -hmm. I love that. I, I, it, it's way too less yogurt than what I would prefer. You know. I like them. I like a lot of fucking yogurt, though. Hi, Stacy. How are you? Oh, Debbie, that's so true. She doesn't make friends. She makes I'm future donators. I'm saving my money. It's tight. Awesome. I'm now thinking about an oversized extra cheese and New York style pizza. Oh, fuck. Don't do this to me. All um, that... All that talk about food that reminds me of freaking soda, and I'm like fucking Jones, and but the hubby's not feeling good, so I'm like, fuck. Oh, that's I'm sure you'll make him go, food. regardless. Oh, that's how you. Oh my God, you can get copper every day. Um, Sherry, let's see. You said how many? You can't how many channels do they have? Rev has one channel on YouTube, and Shani has this channel on Twitch, and I believe she's got 26 subscribers, um, a little over a thousand followers, and Rev's got about 15, 1,600 followers on YouTube, but he has not been going on his channel on YouTube in a long time, so... Hi, Tinkerbell! They're not begging yet, Tinkerbell. I got a chicken statue. 
You found an artifact. The curator of the local museum might want to know about this. Well, he can wait till fucking Sunday. Okay? You know why I go Sunday? Cause church, you know, you got you can't forget about God at the end of the day. You you gotta you gotta worship him. Today's Saturday though. So yeah, I go in town on Sunday. No the fuck you don't to give my love to the Lord. No the fuck she don't. Is she talking about the you game? Know? I just don't, you know, stand back and say, no, Lord, I can't. I'm a loner. No, I I love the Lord. Because when you got nobody, at least you got God. She does not go to church. What is she trying to say? She's so and full of it. That's all that matters. She's talking about the game? She must be, because I know she doesn't Holy go. Holy shit. What's up, Firefly? What the hell was that sound? Twenty-one. 21 mixed seeds. There we go. There's no church in Stardew Valley? Well, then she's full of shit. Because this bitch ain't... If she stepped foot in a church, she'd probably bust into flames. Right after walking in the door. That's all I need left. Alright. This is gonna be nice. Man. Alright. Oh, uh, it's so boring, guys. Can't handle Nice. Her. This gaming shit she does. I just, ugh. Puts me to sleep. You know. Maybe things, in a minute. Things are, things are looking up, you know? It's 9 a.m. and... What? It's not you know, 9? Luther wants me to go to archaeology. She's you know. got to be talking Willie about the game. wants me to go to the beach. I'm trying to save up to get a freaking furnace already. Yeah, she's talking about the game. I'm good. What was that, Stacy? I'm gonna leave soon and get lunch, McDonald's or Subway, then mailing stuff, then work. Bubba, black sheep me. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, Shanny, you are now thinking about a cheesy, crunchy but No, stop. <laughs> what no. do you mean? So, Don't do that to a fat girl. I've that's got an idea, girl, guys. That's that's mentally damaged men. Yeah, but where Trina, where it's Shanny's at, it's actually an hour ahead of me. So it's 12.35 where Shanny's at. Organize. What would you guys think, of, if I can talk my husband into coming on with me, what would you guys think about us uh, playing some trivia yeah. and stuff while we watch her be boring and play games? Said Leaf. You're always beautiful. Aww. We got a game, a trivia game we can You're play. You're sweet. All right, we're going to sleep. And you guys could get in on the fun somehow, See, too. See, that's what's so great about days like this is it really does go by fast. It's just regular in. trivia for now, although Silent you know. Sledge is has been coming up with get Danny away you here. damn fucking crows that was my fucking plant you bastard jesus christ she's so loud what the fuck that was bullshit did you see that fucking crow eat my fucking food like that like that was that's needed for seed baron. Hey David, how are you doing this morning, David? What a bastard. I should eat that crow. Take a slingshot and like whoop its ass and then, you know, just eat it on my freaking fire pit. I think I'm gonna do this the um shanty trivia with you guys. Fucking like ask asshole. you guys the shanty trivia questions. Cause I don't think I wouldn't be fair to play that with Michael. He doesn't know enough about her. I would beat him. Boy, if I actually did that in real life, I'd be like huffing my ass. What's off. up, JB? <gasps> Hi, Aaron. <sighs> uh, but still cussing out the fucking bird. Fucking asshole. That's just rude. All right. 
Babe, yeah, are you still I can watching? Go this way Michael? and just go down here to You want me to send you the water. link so you can jump on and we can I play some trivia? Well. I think trivia. that might be the first thing I build is Oh, a well. that's a good idea, Silent Sledge. David, you're a caregiver now? I wasn't supposed to leave. I failed my challenge. That just didn't happen. Did you get a We're new job, gonna... David? We're not. Or are you taking care of family? Technically, it's not town, okay? That was an accident. I was just testing. That shouldn't have happened. I apologize. <laughs> Yeah, Hubert, I can go do to that. The store and sell stuff. I would have really fa failed my challenge. Let's see, Mick. Yeah. Hubris wanted me to tell you that he loves Love. you, and you are gorgeous, gorgeous girl. There you go, Hubris. Hope that was good. Um, David, yeah. does she make any money on this? Not much. More she makes coppers. a little, but not much. Yeah. You got a new job, David? That's awesome. You're gonna get rocks. That's gonna be a rewarding job, you know, David? Doing stuff it's like nice that. Chopping the rocks. It's you know? you know gonna be stressful and have its its get a bunch um of stone. problems as well. But Everybody wants to get you'll be stoned. you'll be feeling like you're really making a difference. You know See, what I mean, David? That's the only place I can get to water things. I like this four corners though. It's really neat, actually. Oh, look at this. There's grass be here. Oh, I sleep, Carl. There should not be grass. You are not allowed. I was on last night, but no grass. We didn't. Um, I didn't go live with this this morning until about what allowed. thirty minutes ago. There. Boy, I'm just taking care of like this stuff. Here's little what I'm gonna do little, while I wait to see if like my hubby wants to come on into like and play trivia. I'm gonna pull up the Shanny trivia yeah, questions yeah. that Silent Sledge sent me, and I'm gonna ask you, you know, guys some of them. How about that? Does that sound like it would be a, a fun we'll thing to do for a little really while? Good freaking money. I don't know. Let me pull them up. We got plenty of seeds though. Hi, Ellen. Okay, you're gonna do still do some you know, DoorDash. That's what we're gonna focus on. It's, it's seed barren. What do you mean? I told you where. Ah, it a geode. You told me what, babe? That you would or wouldn't? I feel we got some breathing room. Yeah, man. What's up, ketchup? My motto is don't be a dick. Okay, I'm gonna or send you the link, babe. A dick to you, Hold on. It's okay for you to be a dick back to them, because they they don't realize you're actually meek and you're a nice person. But Shani, you know what? Sometimes you gotta fight. You are not like, meek. Fuck it. You are don't not meek. Don't abuse me, Shani. I'm a Good girls. That's one thing you are definitely not, and that's meek in any kind of way. Oh, so. snap. We got another seed. That's sweet. We got 12. I just sent you the link, babe. 12 copper ores. All right, let's see here. While we wait for him for a second, let me pull up some of these right. shiny questions. Sorry, I was busy bathing the piggies and rabbit while playing this on TV <clears> for them to watch. Thank you, Shanny, for your stream. Helped keep my piggies and rabbit calm for their baths. Aww. Oh. Yeah. All right. Exactly. They started the dickery. Are you guys I didn't ready? Start the dickery. I Are didn't you ready be for the down. first Shanny question? Aha! Beautiful. All right. Aha. You see Get ready, how? guys. That was karma, you see? That fucking crow came along, ate my fucking plant, destroyed it, 
and then I found some grass, some weed, and then I planted the said seed, uh, the seed of like, right. love and enjoyment. I'm and turning her down for a second to uh, ask you guys the question. All right. Ba -ba -ba -bum. What archangel does Shani claim to be? What archangel does Shani claim to be? That would be the shit. I love bunnies. I love bunnies too. Oh, and we got some answers. You know what? Panda. My camera is Panda dead. got it first. Let's but you guys this. are correct. Fuck this shit, man. Shani claims to be Sandalfine. Oh, Pirate Hacker, you know, I don't You'll think... You'll be here with me. I don't think that's an Archangel, is it? No, Gabriel is an Archangel, so we'll that's talk right, together. too. we together. That's right, too. So you got it right as well, Pirate Hacker. It's either Gabriel or Sandalfon. Or Sandalfon. I love bunnies. I like bunnies, too. One of Bunnies together. are cute. Good job. Let me see. Let's get another one for you guys. Snow bunnies! You know what? I got no energy. I got shit to do. All right. I can't even buy that bar thing. Can I Next question. What condition did Shani cause in Jason from quitting alcohol cold turkey? What condition did Shani cause in Jason from quitting alcohol cold turkey? YouTube, they are my fave. Ah, well, wet brain. Panda, what? Oh, no, 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 not panda. Let's see, we got some level other one mining pick ass. It looks like Coraline Ooh, cherry bomb. Got it first. I can make some cherry bombs. But everybody so that guessed got it right. Fuck her up. Coraline, Firefly, Channel 69. That would be awesome. Shaw, Serotonin, Dustin, Kim, Panda, Aaron, Mo, Scott, Jessica, Rainbow Pixie. You guys all got Ooh, it right. Holy in. shit. Good job, guys. I can chop wood. All right. Let's see. What's another one here? We chop in the wood. Chop, chop in the wood. We chop in broccoli. La, 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 la. They're all we laying down broccoli. now after bathing and eating again. Oh, that's so she cute. She chop it. She chop it. To our valued <laughs> Jojo Mart customers, our team members. All right. Shut up for a second, Shani. Next question. We're going to do one more, and then I'm going to see if Michael's ready to join me for our trivia game. What comic character was Shani cosplaying when she called Jason Mr. J? What comic character was Shani cosplaying when she called Jason Mr. J? They have cause. As always, we value your continued support. Good job, guys. What a dick one, it looks man. like some idiot got it first. Good job, some idiot. But What's that? all you guys some got bunkers. it right. I see you got some shades on me. Good job, guys. Y'all got it. It's Harley Quinn. We apologize for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As oh, always, you got them both first, Serotonin? Hold on, let me go back and look. Morage, Georgia Customer Satisfaction Representative. Well, fuck, man. All I can do um, is, like, clear this. Serotonin, it didn't... I don't see your your answer where you got it. Hold on, let me go back to this other one, too. Yeah, go back and look, Serotonin, because you didn't get it first, time. Let me make sure on my phone and see if it's different there, because on what I'm seeing it come up, you didn't get it first. Let's see. Yeah, Serotonin, you didn't get it first, hon. The, the wet brain one, the first one to get that one <clears throat> was Coralie. And for Harley Quinn, the first one to get that one was some idiot. So that's at least that's what it shows up as on my end. But you did good. 
if the it may be that them if the chat's delayed or something like that that may be an issue like with having you guys play you know what i mean because it might be hard to get everybody to be able to have a fair go of it or something do i like taylor swift everyone's uh, chat is different oh well then that would make that um, difficult I don't really know Hi, Vera. Her enough to make Hi, Luna. that conclusion. I apologize, Serotonin, though, for any confusion. I'm kind of old, so I listen to old music. That's how I function. Her new album is fantastic, really. I haven't, I, 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 I wouldn't know. I'll be honest. I listen to old music. Oh, yeah, that might be it. See, on my end, let me see. I don't know what's wrong with me. Is it on live chat or talk I'm chat? I'm just like, new that music? might have an effect Ew. on it as well. But see, I can't choose. Um, I go, I stream through Melon. And that's where I'm seeing you guys, you know, your comments and stuff. And it doesn't give me the option of choosing to um, do it live or top. So that might be affecting it, too, because it might be coming through as top chat, chat, top chat. I never thought about that, but that might be the what's going on. That might be why some people think I forget to say stuff to them and everything, too, because on my end, it might not be showing up. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I need to uh, make sure everybody knows that I'm about the way I, I do things shopping. or whatever. It's 10.30 a.m. I'm chopping till my heart's content. There's, there's like probably an artifact in here right here. No, it's cold. Wait a minute. It's not bad. Some idiot. There's a form of, there's a strain of COVID, a new variant that makes your teeth fall thing. out. What? That's terrifying. That is scary as all Take get out. These little sticks. Oh, we got a Michael. We got a Michael. Are you there, babe? I'm in here. Everybody, welcome. Michael is here to save the day. <clears throat> Janny, oh my god, oh, she's boring. At you. So, the trivia game we got, maybe you guys have heard of it. It's called All of Us. It's, I guess, is it a fairly new trivia game, you think? Go. I don't know. I don't know, but it's about, it's like generationally divided, so. Right. There are questions for millennials, for Gen X, Gen Z, boomers. Yeah. Well, we'll um, we're not quite boomers, in but. cleaning everything out. No. I grew up playing Trivial Pursuit. That's what do I was any, looking for. Do any you know, of you guys Friday, um, we got play Trivial Pursuit? I was trying to think of a way where we here. could do that catchphrase game that was and, and fun. It'll though. be Sunday. That is a fun game. Right. Hi, Miss Mud Duck. And then hopefully we can buy some like seeds and shit. Is she just talking about the game? Listen to Taylor Swift Shake It Off song. It's about haters. I think of you'll course, like that song worst. a lot. I mean, she's the worst. This is, if she thinks this is her career, I shall try trouble. it. And doesn't she seem like she's high? Of course. With my me. might. She's high on calories. Yeah. Not promising anything. <laughs> high on ding dongs and Twinkies. All right. Hi, on baby about carrot. To start, so said shop. It's about to right. start. Actually, Shorten technically, pixie sticks and today is smoking Twinkies <laughs> like Twinkies like cigars. Which means I ain't gonna do shit today <gasps> no. on shop it. I'll be honest. What is she doing now? I'll be honest. Be honest about what? I'll be honest. 
Shani's high on her own farts. <laughs> and Rev's Best high on them too. Mechanic has a son crunk pipe. That's my chill, chill jam. It's old. <laughs> <laughs> I'll listen to Taylor Chips. Taylor Swift song. Oh, damn. She is really... I'll hard, be though. right back. Mm -hmm. I gotta take a pee-pee. Ew. Oh Talk amongst each other. We don't need to know. Just you say you need to go party. will love each other forever. Yes. We will do that. Yeah, she's high. Yeah. Yep, something's up. She is most definitely high out of her mind. All right. Which um ones are we going to do? The green ones Who's, or the yellow ones? Did somebody say that there's a covid strain that causes your teeth to fall out yeah what is that do you know anything about that i i don't know but i think shanny caught it if so <laughs> she does she has she actually does tell the truth i guess about some illnesses that she has because she got covid that made her teeth fall out Hold on um, a are you looking it up or something yeah Google that shit. Google that shit. Doctor Google, tell me. All right. Oh, uh, there, there's no evidence yet that it causes, but tooth infection can be related to tooth loss and. And it can COVID cause that. COVID is an infection. There's no. I mean, it says there's no evidence. But it's. They think can that it make might be. Out? I have not... It sounds like COVID can do a lot of shit. It says there are thousands of people reporting COVID affecting their teeth they think it may just be that the infection gets in the gums and causes tooth mm. loss and decay wow still COVID that's scary yeah all right let's do some of this trivia do you want to do the yellow or the green ones first um let me see what the one is 1981 to 1996 that's green and then the newer one 1997 to 2015 is yellow <laughs> uh, let's do the green first because I don't think I'll have a I knew I you were going to pick that the, I don't know much of the newer I knew you were going to pick that because that's the ones that I am I would probably do better than you at but alright who's going Who? how are we going to do this you want to go first I'll ask you first everybody okay. keep score yeah well what we'll do is I'll keep score here on the side hold on let me get a piece of paper real quick and we'll do like um, I don't trust you though Oh shut up! Especially if if OnlyFans is in the in the mix as a reward. Oh, sure oh, that's what we need to do though. We need to figure out what the reward. What are we gonna do? Is that what you want to do? Is like no uh, hell no. Not, do it. Not, no. The, not that yeah. specifically. Not that specifically. But oh, to be it, able to watch. Uh, okay, if you win, to, you pick the OnlyFans we watch. If I win, I pick the OnlyFans we watch. No, that's not what I was talking about either, weirdo. I'm just talking about videos in general. Like, we could do it so then, like, the next um, stream that we do together where we're not covering Shanny and we're just covering things we want to cover, you could pick one, then I could pick one, and we can, like, have time That's to cool. figure out yeah. which ones we're going to do. All yeah. right, so what do we you want to do, like, best out of ten wins? Sure. First one to get ten right. Gets to pick the, the video. Sure. All right. And then... If we do another one, we'll um, do that. All right. Are we, are we taking chat help or no chat help? No chat help. That would be cheating, wouldn't it? I think so. So no chat help. Everybody refrain from giving the answers until after um, we go. If, if we don't get them, then we'll give you guys the opportunity to... I'm keeping to... them as high and tight as I can, Teddy Bear. <laughs> All right, so I'm, I'm going first. I'm coming up in May for sure. Let's do this. All right, here I go. Her song, Bitty Bitty Bum Bum, was released in 1994. Selena. Yep. So I got one right. Go. Now I ask you? I think so. All right. Neither light as a feather nor stiff as a board, this spooky 1996 film features four teenage girls who learn witchcraft. The craft. Yeah. Yeah, go. This animated series chronicles the adventures of Tommy Pickles. Rugrats. Yep. 
this musical artist and actress famously wore a dress styled after a white swan to the 2001 Academy Awards. Oh my god, what was her um What is her name? The Swedish singer? I don't um, know. What's her name? I can't remember. What is her name? Uh, you better not. You better not be googling anything over there. I can't remember what her name is, babe. Um, I can't remember. Bjork. Bjork. Oh my god. So you didn't get that one. Go. What automaker's 2007 S80 was the first car to market with an autom automated braking system? What car company? Yeah. S80? In 2007, S80. Mercedes Benz? Volvo. Uh -huh. I didn't get it. Alright. Next is yours. What world icon was tragically killed in, in August 1997 car crash? You know this one. Oh, Princess Di. Yeah. Nelson Mandela was the first black, fully de democratically elected president of what nation? Africa. P right? Close. I mean, I'm, I'm, you're only going to get half a point, or I can give you a hint. And Wait, am I not, wrong? Yes, you're wrong, because it's Africa isn't a country, it's a continent. Oh, oh. Um. But it is in the name. That is in the name. Oh, my God. It's not Africa, and it's not North Africa, but it's... South Africa? Correct. What, are you going to give that? I sure, don't, you can have that one. No, that's not really... You gave... That was too easy, then, because you pretty much gave me the answer. No, we're not cheating okay. like that. So I didn't get that one. All right, your turn. This TV show about a mother and daughter living in a small town in Connecticut debuted uh, in 2000 on the WB. Mom? Nope. Gilmore Girls. Oh, hell, I would never know. In addition to having his own sitcom from 2001 to 2006, this actor and comedian yeah, starred that, in films that is correct. such as My Ocean's mic was Eleven, mute. I didn't even fucking Mr. Realize 3000, it until Guess Who, right now. and Soul Men. But I'm back. Ah, oh, it's a beautiful Saturday day. Hold on. Let me think about this. Read it again. I'm getting a In large addition to having his own sitcom from 2001 to 2006, McDonald's. this actor and comedian oh, starred in films such as Ocean's Eleven, Mr. 3000, Guess Who, and Future Soul Man. Teller. And he's not alive anymore. Alright. Oh, God. You fucking crow! Oh, you piece of fucking shit asshole! I don't know. I don't Bernie know. Mac. Oh, wow. I haven't thought about him in so long. Okay. Next one for you. An athletic fad in the 90s. Roller skates came back in this new form. Roller I know blades. I gotta get a scarecrow yeah. built, but no scarecrow has you been built yet. One. You're gonna get this whole card, I think. Blind Melon released its 1993 hit scarecrow. along with its iconic video. Featuring the B girl character. No rain. What yeah. a piece of shit. The 1996. Can you turn her down, babe? Can you turn her down? I. Yeah. Like, why? She's annoying as shit. The 1996 musical comedy Kazam features this NBA legend in a Shaquille starring role. Shaquille O'Neal. Yep. According Why? to the title of a sitcom featuring Debbie, Danny no. DeVito, Debbie. It's Always Sunny in Which Don't City? Philadelphia. Yeah. What? No. Uh, this TV show is about a young Clark Kent. Smallville. Yep. In 1994, FIFA World Cup was held in which country? Okay. Oh my god. I don't know. Brazil? I don't know. The U.S. Oh, fuck. Alright. 
Consumer quadcopters have been dubbed Not what here. nickname? I know there's a lot of stones scattering around your farm. If you have a surplus, you might consider Drone. me and build a yep. well for you. I actually, Which performer I actually released the number one hit, That's the Way Love Just Goes, in 1993? Janet Jackson. Yep. And After having had roles in the comedy or in the Cosby show and hanging with Mr. Cooper, this 2000s teen star got a show named after her in 2003. What is her um I can't remember her name. No more guess? You're not gonna no, guess? I don't, I don't know. Raven Simone. Raven. I would have Okay, you go. The 1998 rom com The Parent Trap features oh, which actress playing twin sisters? Lindsay Lohan. Yep. I What's the score? Six to six. Get out of town. I'm winning by so much. You're such a cheater. You're the worst. Are we going to who gets to 10 first? Or are we just yeah. doing the, be you know, the best out of 10 questions? No, no. Whoever gets to the score of 10 first. Do you got to win by two? Let's make the rules clear. All right. Let's take a break for a second and hear All what right. she's talking about. Make sure she's not talking about anything interesting. That's awesome. Well, I have a guess for she's that trivia question. No, she's sell. not. For tomorrow. <laughs> She really is, like, boring you know? when she does this. The fucking worst. Well, I guess there's all for me to do is chop some fucking motherfucking wood. <laughs> Let's do this shit. Chop some motherfucking fucking yeah. wood. Motherfucking chop some motherfucking chop wood. Some trees down. Even chopping. the ghost of my motherfucking dead mother knows it. I'm chopping broccoli. She chopping, she chopping, she chopping, she chopping, she chopping. She broke a lot of Wow, she really is just. If she can sit and do this, they dude, why can't she get a job? Like I don't get that. She literally She's could just pathetic. sit. She could just sit and answer phones. They're I mean, pathetic. how is they that any they're different? They're so entitled. They think that people owe them their money. They should be allowed to do what they want. Like, come on. Who has the job that they want? Right? People. Right. Nobody. Shit. Even celebrity, even like actresses and actors take jobs they don't like. You know what I mean? Like roles they don't necessarily like. Like, like nobody is going to have it. I mean, the quiet's nice. It's not life. And the birds chirping. Ugh. All right. Rev Let's babbling and blah, 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 blah. I that love watching to her game ears. playing. That's most of the things I do. Like, there's like these people are so unaware that I, I don't being a teacher around these days them. Is the worst. Hold on, that they honestly are. Hold on. I watch their shit, and I don't. I will literally usually watch gaming shit. Things that make me happy. Then how do you know what we what's on our our shows and our channels? Yeah, she's full of shit. She's full make of me shit. feel fulfilled with my life. Wait, That's what watching I a gaming channel makes you feel fulfilled? Well, She's worse off than I thought, people. Tomorrow we got some parsnips to sell. And we can buy oh some God. seeds with them. So, even though it's 12.30 p.m. Oh, 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 oh. Scarecrow. Huh? All right. I need to get let's go back to the game again for a minute. All right. To get a Whose bro. question was it? Oh, I don't remember. I what think was it was it? mine. I think you were about to ask me one. All right. Drew Barrymore plays the lonesome lead role of Josie Geller in which 1999 classic rom-com? The wedding Rosie singer. Josie. Is it the wedding singer? It is not. What is it? Never been kissed. Oh gosh! All right. All right. Featuring Burt Reynolds among its voice cast, this 1989 animation tale or animation tells of an angel dog returning to Earth to learn about friendship. 
I loved this movie. All dogs go to heaven. Yep. I had that movie and I liked it a lot. I saw it in the I theater. Love, I love dogs. All right. This alternative rock band is fronted by Eddie Vedder. Pearl Jam. Yep. That was pretty easy. All right. This sitcom, which starred, started airing in 1998, is a throwback to an earlier decade. That 70s show? Yeah, that's easy. Go. Before quickly becoming unfashionable, this functional accessory was worn around many people's waists. Fanny pack. Yeah. What pop star was born Catherine Elizabeth Hudson? What is her name? Katy Perry. Yep. As the Fresh Prince theme song tells us, Will Smith was born and raised where? I know you're singing the song in your head, aren't you? The playground? Where was he born and raised? In oh. West. Hold on. Philadelphia? In which region of Philadelphia? West Philadelphia. Yeah, that's right. All right. You're going to get this one and you're going to win. Is it nine to nine? Yeah. But you got to win by two, so you got to get one wrong for me to win. What song, Colors of the Wind, appears in this Disney film? Pocahontas. Yep. St. Louis Cardinals slugger Mark McGuire and Chicago Cubs star Sammy Sosa duked it out over hitting the most what? Home runs. Yes. Somebody's got to miss one or we're going to go on forever. This brand of toy guns shoots foam darts. Nerf. I don't need headphones. Which band was behind 1993's hit Two Princes? The Spin Doctors. Nice. Oprah Winfrey launched this periodical in 2000, oh. featuring herself on the cover. O Magazine? Oh, yeah. I thought you were saying, oh, like, oh, <laughs> I didn't know that you were going there yet. Man, you're going to, I might lose if I get one wrong. Who is the co-creator and star of the original British version of The Office? Oh, no. What is it? Yes, thank you, God. Ricky Gervais? Yep. How, oh, my God. This, this MTV show lets you vote on what they'll play. TRL. Yep. In 1999, what hockey great retired from the sport with 61 records to his name? Do what now? Say it again. What What hockey player do you know the name of? None of them. You don't know one hockey player's name? Like an old hockey player? No. Wayne Gretzky? Yeah, I wouldn't have guessed it. All right. Well, so I get this one. You won. Right. Well, you gotta. I gotta get oh. one right and win by two. Which singer featured Santana's 1999 hit single "Smooth"? Rob. And it's just like the young. Uh, uh, Rob. It's the uh, same speed of motion. I know it's Matchbox it's 20. What's his name? Rob. Uh, Thomas. You know it. Yeah. So now you won. Right? Yeah. That was fun. It's so fun when I win. I would go back to this dumb bitch. To support this facility here. So you get one video uh, so far. I ask. <laughs> my lower viewers. And we'll take a break from this for a second. Donating. I think I'm about to go make a coffee in a second, too. And pay bail. Since I just I jumped up and came on here. Or, my dear wonderful folks... You don't also have to do that. You could also press the subscribe button by play, paying five ninety nine, and you'll get some wonderful content here. Thank you, guys. And are you complaining about the ads? But you must wonderful understand, content, my ads. ads are for 
supporting the establishment of entertainment so they can have a home. Huh? They can pay rent. You don't this pay isn't rent. Gonna be, this isn't going to be your career, Shannon. Next time we'll do the Gen Z, it'll give you a... I don't know advantage. about you, but around the 15th, Shannon's going to have to be paying a big, massive... Uh, Eden Bill. Get a job. You know the state of Pennsylvania here in this facility. The state of fucking Pennsylvania. What is she doing? This is so fucking stupid. Has uh, made huh? electricity and gas go up about 30% for this winter, even though last year it went up the same. So that's 60% from two years ago. So, folks. Sounds like Shannon and Rev paying next. Like, get the fuck out of here. Winter. Everyone's having to deal with it. If you have arthritis, make sure to know that medical marijuana does work. Oh, God. Here we go with that shit. So, legalize it. That is all. God, she can't ever use a cup. She just drinks out of a two There are a few people as go. disgusting. There are a few people as disgusting as these two. Yeah. My Alex Jones impersonation. That was Alex Jones? Foragen. Huh? Man. The fuck? <coughs> Can you handle this for a minute so I can go make a coffee? It's Sunday, folks. W wait, what? W wait, we what? We can go shopping. To, what do you want me to do? What am I supposed to do? What do I do? Shut, an shut extra up. Team what if, I don't know what. Like, Just I'm going to be on the controls? No. Well, stir no. Fry. Yeah, kind of. Do I have to do anything? Kind of do I have to know anything? Stir fry. Michael, scared. I will fucking hurt you. <laughs> Shut your mouth. Jason's fine. All right, Jason guys. He's fine. gonna take over just for a second. I'm gonna go make something to drink, and he's probably gonna, like, gonna dip out in a minute. Okay? He's gonna be bored from this I'm way. I might dip out. Him so much. Will you make me one? We can keep playing trivia. Do you want one like mine? And I'm like, sure. calm down. He's okay. Is that what you want or no? No, you don't yeah. understand. Okay, I'll be right back, guys. Bring me my dip too, woman. He looks like something really bad has been happening to him. Dude, Teddy There's Bear, that's, an that was gonna be my choice. There ain't no echo anymore, is there? <laughs> Bet you there isn't an echo. An echo. That's true. What did you guys think of the of the trivia? Is that something that I feel like there has to be a way to like incorporate you guys into it, like maybe Carrie asked the questions and do it like through the chat. She said she did that, but I wasn't. I was trying to get on here to do it. Um, but I think like maybe having either somebody come on to be in the trivia or to ask the questions. They freak out. We'll the figure out a way. The fucking things. As you gain experience, you discover new crafting recipes to increase profit and make life easier. A scarecrow, for example, will prevent crows from snacking on your precious crops. A trivia bot in got Discord. One thing I was thinking is there's this app I have me, that's just like a trivia game. I don't know what it's called. Um, oh, but yeah. I got to give stuff to like Gunther. Questions off of it. Because we'll run out of these oh, cards yeah, sooner or later. Take that out. Put that there. Um. Yeah, we can put that in right now. Take that. That goes to... One of them goes to Gunther. The other one's going to be Solve! 
Yeah, I know that there's there's some kind of weird way that the okay. chat works too, because mine were showing up in different order. Um, there's been a couple weeks. I don't know why or what I was doing. I think maybe it's like just whoever has we'll faster internet gets in there, there faster, and that and put a scarecrow a little bit of an there issue. and put a scarecrow. Wait, 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 wait. We want to move this fucker. Um, I don't we'll know if I have him. a favorite Elvis wait. song. I'm trying to grab I like... you. Mm, ain't nothing but a hound dog. We went to. Will you let me? Will you let me grab you? Oh wait, for Christmas I know how a couple to do years this. ago. Sorry, I was trying I to see if she was saying something. Ass. Gary's gonna there be mad if I make you guys miss something. There, there we go. That's even. Baby, it sounded like there was someone by the door. One minute, guys. Is... Oh my god. All right. Who knows what's going on now? I'm going to ask myself questions and see if I get the answers. That would be great if it's the uncle, if it's CPS, if it's the cops, if it's... Um, Really, I can't think. G-Man? G-Man would be great. Maybe it's the uncle with G-Man. <laughs> he might have door-dashed a prostitute. Haven't seen any fights yet, but I think it's honestly just a matter of time with these guys. They said they got their EBT, I don't know, it was the night before last, I think. Whenever the second hit, like midnight is the second. Um, and that's why they're not begging. Give it a couple days, that'll be gone. Or when they need cigarettes. And the thing that I've been thinking is, you can't buy pet food, animal food, with EBT. That is a lot. Do you guys hear the blender? It's loud. Um, yeah, so these people, these idiots. So they're not buying cat food with the EBT. So they're getting food, but the cats aren't. They door dash donuts and coffee the morning of, but you can't buy that with EBT either, so somebody gave them money. But see, but honestly, some idiot, I, I mean, I get that you might have been kidding, um, but I think about, that's what I was talking to Carrie about. If you're in that dire of straits, and you are going, I wouldn't starve. I would, I would shoplift. I, I would do whatever I had to do for my family. Honestly, though, like before getting to the shoplifting level, I would have got a fucking job. The, the thing that blows my mind is that these guys, that doesn't even enter into the, the realm of possibility. Like getting a job is not a possibility. It is beg. They think that this online shit is going to be their career. And the thing that has Carrie doing this has showed me it. They do not have a prayer. They don't have a fucking prayer. I, the sheer amount that they would have to generate to make money or enough to live off of, I mean, they're not going to get there. Carrie is making nothing. Like I, I won't tell you exactly, but it's 
<laughs> so much less than I thought. And this honestly, just from the generosity of like people who watch her, like from ad revenue and stuff, it was less than 20 bucks, less than $20. I mean, and I was reading like what Twitch gives you, you get, I think it said 350 per 1000, uh, views of the ads. I mean, there's no way. I think I might've been a little low, but also she five ninety nine per subscriber. She has 20 of those. Melissa Mefford. Thank you so much for the super sticker. I'm sure Carrie will thank you personally when she gets back, but I really appreciate it. And I know she will too. Let me see what I saw on Twitch. Okay, so you average $250 per 100 subscribers. So you're making $2.50 per subscriber. She has what? Even it says she has 30 of those. So she's making 70 bucks a month from her subscribers. And then ad revenue. Let's see. Well, I don't need a straw. <laughs> Nothing. She's being boring as usual. As per usual. Hers or ours? Bruce Collins, thank you for the super chat. Bruce said, thanks, Mike and Carrie. You guys give me much entertainment via the two clowns on Twitch. I appreciate that. And I'm sure Carrie does as well. And we'll, she said she's coming back right now. What was that? I was looking at Twitter. Okay, I'm back, guys. Sorry about that. I had to get my... I'm addicted to these frozen drinks, these um coffee drinks that I've been making. Oh, and I needed to go to the bathroom and go potty. Didn't need to get any more graphics than that. Unlike Shani, I don't have to tell you guys that much. So I didn't miss anything. She's just been being boring. Hell no. What is she Man, saying she's doing some... now? Somebody was at the door or somebody was looked sound like they were by the door. And oh. so I mean I've been I was looking at like how much people on Twitch Hi Mustela. Oh, and thank you for the super chats, guys. I heard that there were Melissa Mefford, uh super sticker and Bruce Collins was a super was chat. A super chat. Thank you guys. I appreciate that. What were you just saying? Sorry about guys, I'm no host. I'm glad Carrie is back. Uh, did somebody, hmm? sorry, hold on. I'm not as good at this as you. <laughs> so the average salary of a Twitch streamer, like this stuff, it kind of blows my mind. Like the average salary is $9,300 per year. That is the average, but yeah. it ranges from $50 to 1500 per month. The $1,500 per month do it 40 hours a week. And have 10K plus subscribers. 10,000 wow. average viewers. Like, they don't have near this. No. Not not even close. And they'll go for through periods where they don't even, where she doesn't come on at all. And then, then she'll be on one day for like eight hours. Like it's On average, Twitch streamers earn 
$3 for every consistent viewer they have per month. $3 per consistent viewer per month. If she has 60 of those, she's making $180 per month. This is not going to be their career. They need to give that shit up. Um, I just don't understand. I can't I believe that with his YouTube channel, because he's got like 1,600 subs, he could start making money on it. Like, he's not even willing to do anything there. But even think about that. Like, can you imagine? Imagine if you were, if this was what you had to try to live on. It, you'd be done. Like, well, but the thing but is, I don't think you would even they don't try because have to pay rent. They don't have hardly any bills. I mean, they could make but it, it work. But it sounds like this is temporary. Like this effort. uncle thing is temporary. They're not going to live oh, yeah. there forever. Oh, and, and I think it's like temporary, like it's going to end real soon because I think he's going to get fed up with them again. Well, I think that they know it's temporary too. Mm -hmm. um, wow, man. Yeah. The, well, I thought numbers. that I thought that Rev said too at some point not long ago since they've been an uncle that he's trying to sell the place. So, you know, if that's, if I remember that correctly, if, if he's trying to sell it, then they could be out at any moment. Because... Oh, yeah. But if, if 200 and whatever, $280 in food stamps doesn't last them, but a few days, then what is $160 in cash money? Cause that's going to go toward drugs, uh, cigarettes, gas, and all their, like, then it's not possible. It is impossible. Yeah. This isn't going to be their job, their career. She is not as popular as she likes to think she is. I mean, she thinks she is famous. No, and but I will the say this. she needs to disavow herself of. If they were smart, they would do fake fights. They would fight like that all the time, stream it, because that is where they get the most views. If they did that, people would be fucking tuning in every day. Wait, are you are you stupid? Excuse are, me? Are you stupid? Excuse are you being, me? Are you being dumb? What's wrong with you? You're, You're being dumb. You obviously you want to die talking to me like that. You're the worst. Have you this not our, watched Snap? This is our fake fight. Let's let's start ours. No. Shut up. What what was the point? Me shut up? You shut up. Don't tell me to shut up. How dare you tell me to shut up? Who do you think you are, Jared Leto? Who do I think I am? Who do you think you are? All right, you're dumb. <laughs> I'm dumb? Me? You're not very good at this, are you? I'm just, I, I was mirroring it. I was saying what you were saying back to me. Jason! I work Jason. my, I work my ass off! So now you're calling me another man's name? Why are you making it seem like I'm making you do this? Oh my god! I didn't want to be on here. People know I didn't want to be on here. Then don't ask for my phone! Ask for your phone. Seriously. But I'm tired of being the only one who's busting their ass! And you sit there and do nothing! You don't even say anything! You look like you're insane! Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> her. <laughs> Yeah, he doesn't really say anything, does he? He's just like, uh -oh. like oh, okay. Shady's not making me do anything. <laughs> She's not making me do this, people. Y'all, my wife is really sick. She's, yeah. She's really sick. And I, I need to get my mental health stuff straight. But I, what I, is she I, I can't make appointments. They take forever to make an appointment. And then I don't show up and... Uh, and I don't have the money. We don't have the money. I can't work mentally. I can't even. I can't even look at the chat. It's just not good for my mental health, guys. If Jason got a job, he'd freak everyone out. Did you see that super chat? Uh oh. Let me see. From Prime Mover. No, I didn't. Hold on, Prime Mover. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Thank you, Prime Mover. You said, "Here's a fiver. Keep fighting." <laughs> 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 see, it works. It works. Thank you, Prime Mover, for the super chat. I appreciate that. What did she... She said something, too. She's like, um, Jason's getting all the sympathy or something, and I'm the one dying. Right. Well, hold, let, let's pull it up. I'll pull that video up real quick right now. Let's see. We'll see exactly what they said since she's gone. Because this is, you know... It's, it's kind of sick to, to say that like their fights are the best things to watch, but they're the best things to watch. 
They're in the most interesting 10 minutes of hours upon hours of footage that they have. But uh, that's honestly just, that's our culture. I mean, think about Real Housewives yeah. shows and stuff. The episodes that do the best are when the ladies oh, flip yeah. on the table and when they're fighting. And yep. That's just how people are. Yep. You got a point. All right, let's see here. I have a point. Are you saying that I have a pointy head? What are you saying? I'm saying I'm. Are you not saying I'm ugly? Slap you in the face if you don't shut up. You're gonna abuse me now. Yes. In front of everyone. All right. While she's gone, I'm listening to see if she comes back. But I want to hear this fight one more time. Let's get to where it gets good. When this gets good, are you saying that they're better than me? <laughs> Shut up, okay? You want to help Rex. out? Um, Shani's PayPal is at Shani Needs Love, and my PayPal is at RevDo if you want to help. Okay, we don't want to help, so. And just so you guys know, I am watching. She's still on the Be Right Back screen. If she pops back up, I'll turn this off and we'll go right back to it. What well, They need to give out the link for people who don't want to help. <laughs> Babe, this coffee is really good. Isn't it? They're I'm addicting. I'm having to fight through the whipped cream, but it's good. <laughs> Dreaming full said, careful. It's in my beard. Carrie's going to beat you with her sex whip. <laughs> like Shanny like beat Rev with the sex whip. Oh, I was about to say, are you, what are you telling him on here? Mm. No, that's it. Which they actually did that. <laughs> uh oh, here we go. Mm. Even the ghost of my mother, mother, dead, dead mother knows it. I know it. You know what? The ghost of my motherfucking mother even knows it. And if I had a job, I'd freak everybody the fuck out. What did he say? <laughs> Because uh, I can't keep a thought in my head for three seconds. If I had a job, or I don't have a job, and if I had a job, I would freak everybody out. <laughs> uh. Can you imagine? That would be. People would be shocked. If he came on and was like, guys, I just got hired at such... We'd be like, what? Can you imagine, if, like, behind the counter and just staring at you? But the thing is, if they if he did that, can you imagine the support they would get? People would be like... Oh my god, finally, here, take five dollars. I want to, you know, uh, uh, congratulate you with this or whatever. Like, people would have a lot more, like, I, that's the thing that they don't seem to get. If they would just try, people would actually probably support them really a lot. Dude, I, that is the... They refuse to do absolutely that, Absolutely ironic thing here. I truly believe if they made some effort, if they changed their, their attitude, ch tried to change their lives started showing that they were doing work to get the kids back. Yep. Even if they started some sort of a, a their own business, like doing some kind of a merch, and they were putting in work, people would buy their shit. Like, if she started doing that crocheting shit, if they would do anything, people would support that. Yeah. But they don't. Nope. They are entitled pieces of shit. Here we you go. said, give me your phone. I did not want to come on here, Shane. You know what, Jason? Are you doing this stuff on purpose just to make me look bad that I'm forcing you to do stuff? No. I'm telling the truth that I did not want to come no. on here. Then don't ask for my phone. It <laughs> make me look like... I I'm hate that part right there where he, like, smiles. It's <laughs> like he does not know what to do. Like, he, he stands up to her for, like, two seconds, and then he's like, what am I doing? Like, I'm about to get my ass beat. Well, yeah, he's like, do I say I didn't ask for your fucking phone? You're a liar, or do I just laugh like he tell he tell he, right? He tells the truth for like two seconds, and then he starts going like, "Oh, what the fuck am I thinking here?" You said give but me. But honestly, your phone. I think it's smart because he knows once the cameras are off, and like right now, she won't do shit. Like she might scream and yell and do all that shit. Once the cameras are off, his ass is grass. I did not want to come on here, Shane. You know what? Jason, are you doing this stuff on purpose just to make me look bad that I'm forcing you to do stuff? No, I'm telling the truth that I did not want to come on here. Then don't ask for my phone. It <laughs> make me look like I'm doing something toward you. 
ask for your phone. I didn't. <laughs> Man at the end of his rope. Yeah. Like, people think I force you to do stuff against that, your will. I don't. You don't think it. And how did she know he didn't want her phone to see if his prostitute could message back? She gets up and she's walking around real well. Do we have any leftovers, babe? I didn't even do leftovers anything. Leftovers what? Food from last night. Pizza? Is that what you're talking about? Food. Are, are you being serious or what are you doing? Yeah, I'm hungry. There's pizza, I think. Why are you asking me? Michael, be quiet so we can hear it. <laughs> Jesus. Now I figured out how to start a fight. Can't do anything for me. Well, I'm sick of my ass. Babe, so shut up. I'm trying to hear. Working her ass off. For what? For what? For what? It says she ended the stream. Did you, are you on Channing still? Oh my god, she did end it. What the fuck? So she didn't even say anything? Did someone show up at the house? Yes, yes. She said it sounds like somebody's at the door. Like, go back, go back and watch it. Because she said it sounds Hold like somebody's up. at the door. Something's going on. This might be a good one. Why does that make me giddy? That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> the way that you said it, too. You're like, this might be I a know, good I one. Know. <laughs> I felt it. I f <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. Where is this at? I wonder if it's the popo. Oh, yeah. Ooh. I gotta give stuff to, like... Go. I wonder if it's the uncle. That's what... You were gone. We were saying this already. You're too late, woman. Damn but, yeah. It. So, I thought I maybe it was everything. the uncle. I thought maybe it was the uncle or maybe G-Man with the uncle. Or just maybe G-Man oh. or the cops. I don't think G-Man... CPS. I don't think G-Man would be stupid enough to just show up. And I don't think CPS would show up because what for what? They don't have kids there. I mean, what are they going to do? serve them with some kind of papers. Or it could be the cops with CPS to serve them with papers saying, listen, we're coming up on six months. You haven't done jack shit. Parental rights are going to be dissolved. You would think that they would probably have called and like told them though that was going to happen if they didn't. But it, you could be right. You could be right. Let's watch. Let me see here. Sure. Oh, wait. I was going to take that out. Are you telling me what to do? you shut up there there we go that's even oh i went too far hold on oh, wait i know how to do this i need my pickaxe there we go i need my pickaxe There, there we go. That's even. Baby, it sounded like there was someone by the door. Uh oh. One minute, guys. That's it? That was it. Baby, it sounded like there was somebody by the door. Because she's sitting by the window that's probably right by Ooh, the front door. Trina, that's a good point because G-Man said he was going to call the uncle. That's what, yeah, that's why we were saying that when 
And I think that it might be. So I think it might be the uncle. Um, maybe what did he say he was going to say to the uncle? That they were coming on here begging for money and stuff? I don't know. I, th- uh, I don't know. But did, was, did G-Man have a new thing? I don't think so. Not new since the other night. Is that something I didn't see? Hold on. I'm pulling it up. Even the ghost of my motherfucking dead mother knows it. Duke of Earl, Earl, Earl. Duke of Earl, Earl, Earl. All right, let's see here. And I'm keeping an eye on uh, the Twitch in case she pops back on. Um, let's see. It was a live stream where he talked about the it. uncle has to know about Jason's Twitch. He's been doing that for years. All right, hold on. Let's let me share the screen with you guys. That was a joke, babe. My gosh, can what? you get a mercy laugh? Somebody said I didn't that, hear it. Somebody said that she, they think they were going to tell him about their Twitch, and I said the uncle has to know about Jason's Twitch because he's been doing that neck thing for years. <laughs> Now okay. I already, I didn't hear you at first. No, Kirk. Just looking at. Let's see. This wasn't very long. So All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Sowing and Reaping uh, YouTube channel. And I just want to just uh, quickly talk about something really quick because I don't want to interfer- in- interfere with nobody else's streams. So um, I was watching uh, Shani live um, on her channel, but uh, uh, I-, I-, I caught the one where Rev was just standing there looking at the camera. And everyone obviously saw that he didn't want to be. Um, that he didn't want to be uh, on film. That he didn't want to be live. And I actually went on Twitch. Uh, if you go look at the comment called uh, Uncle Drew, that was me. And I had told Shani oh. that she owes me an apology, right? Uh, Wait and a I minute. told her to stop making Rev go so live. So he was on there under the thing and under the name An- Uncle Drew? Uncle Drool, I thought he said. Hold up. Uh, if you go look at the comment called uh, Uncle Drew, that was me. Is it and Drew or Droll? I don't know. It sounds like he's saying want to be, it might uh, be Drew, but he's just saying it in a X or like a. He didn't want to be lying. Inflection. And I actually went on Twitter. Uncle Drew. Uh, if you go look at the comment called uh, Uncle Drew, that was me. And I had told like Shandy that she owes me an apology, right? Uh, and I told her to stop making Rev go live. Um, and the last couple of videos I made about Rev was mean. They were really mean. So this particular video is going to be nice in the sense that I'm going to empathize with him. You see, if I was in his position and I was going and I went through everything that this man recently went through and everything uh, and, 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 and I made it clear that I didn't want to be live. Then guess what? I don't want to be live. Don't try to manipulate me. Don't try to make me. Don't try to force me. Don't try to do any of those things to try to make me sit there and go live and do what Shani obviously wants to do. You see, Shani is addicted to YouTube fame, and that's what she wants. She wants YouTube fame. I've heard her say in a previous video that she's been doing this for, what, 15, 20 years, whatever, and she sees other other YouTubers getting paid, and she wants to get paid, you know, for, for the time that she's done on here and everything and whatnot, for the time that she's been on here. And... She's so, she's so obsessed with that that do you know how long Shannon really had like has she been doing this for if if you've been doing it for even I would say five years and she is at the level she is now still can't make she claims it on. she's been doing it for twenty years but if that's you, the case then YouTube then hasn't been around yet for twenty years but she's been on on YouTube for you know what fifteen years but if that's the case. So YouTube started February, uh, launched on December 15th, 2005. Mm -hmm. So (laughs) not even 20, but if she's been doing any kind of anything like this social media for 10, five years and you haven't made it, if if, if that's just, then it's not going to happen. She thinks she has made it. You're insane if you're still doing it. She think that's what's weird though. They think that they have made it. And like the other day they were talking about something and, and Red was talking about how, good he was doing because uh he was like i had 60 people in there watching me like that was the best thing ever and i'm like 60 that's not even a lot then their goal then their goal can't be to to live on it because i mean i i like i just think they're like delusional with the shit like they literally are yeah you know how they think that it's at any moment they're gonna really blow up break out and go viral you know what i mean and it's not gonna happen 
<laughs> it's just they're not that entertaining, but they really believe that they are. That's where the delusional part is. See, I, because, I wonder that sometimes, like, if they believe their own hype, like, because so I think Jason they do. says that he thinks Shani is. Um, I think he believes entertaining it. and beautiful. And, like, I, I don't think, know. I think especially he believes it. I question whether or not she truly believes it. Is that body dysmorphia by proxy? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> All I know is that he thinks that she's so talented, and oh, uh, it, it's just. Because, well, the other, and he looks up, he, he, he's dumb. He doesn't know how stuff works because he's like, if you Google or you put in Shani, the first thing that comes up is Shani's video. That, and it's not. It only does that well, that's because your, that's what they're watching. Right. That's yeah, your he's Google He's that account. dumb that he doesn't get this shit. He thinks that in the world, Shani is the most. Yes. Like, come on, dude. Yes. He does. He really does. All right, let's listen to the rest of the shit that Sorry. G-Man says, just so we can see what he said. She he doesn't care who she's awful. got to destroy and who she's got to go through in order to achieve this so-called goal of hers on YouTube to achieve YouTube fame. She has not... Punched the entire house I'm not saying YouTube fame. <laughs> she's trying to achieve social media fame. The only thing... Uh-oh. Is ...increasingly hated on here. That's the only fame that she's... um um uh, uh is accomplishing on here and that's just being hated nothing she does moving forward except for owning the things that she's done is going to fix that nothing she does is going to fix it she's always going to be hated on here because she's going to be looked upon as being a user which she is as being a plotter which she is as being a selfish prick which is exactly what she is a christian she is not all right I love um, he starts enunciating. And what just kind of got to me was, is that the man so aggravated with going live that he was like, why don't you just break up with me? Like, I think he's starting to understand that he's really in the position to say that stuff now. Because at the end of the day, Shani is in his uncle's house. Mm-hmm. The uncle, see, blood is thicker than water. His uncle is going to be there for him no matter what. However, Shani... Mm -hmm. she's expendable Ooh. and she better start and if and if somebody if g-man like went to him and not only talked to him but said watch this video and see, sees oh. her berating jason like she did that might piss the uncle off and be like i and want that bitch out of my house maybe g-man showed him the video and heck when the cops like so now the uncle knows the cops are coming to his house and mm -hmm. he doesn't want mm -hmm. police interaction at his house is going to make mm -hmm. and the neighbors might be calling him too like you never know the cops showed up the neighbors might know the uncle right well just and just that I, I, I would think he would have to be angry to see that she's saying like, like saying you don't do shit for me and blah blah but like when literally right she she wouldn't fucking have a roof over her head right now if it wasn't for him and and he's she's talking to him like that like he's not bringing anything to the, the fucking table and the relationship not only is that but he's freaking went through they went through 750 grand of his money what do you mean oh you yeah have, i wonder what the uncle thinks about that i mean yeah it's like you have a lifetime to catch died, up right? with yeah you have a lifetime and that's the the thing too that a lot of people think and i think it's true that's the only thing that 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 reason that they're there right now is that the uncle does feel bad for jason because he lost both of his parents young he has no one he doesn't have siblings his uncle is pretty much all he has Oh, yeah. I mean, I can, like, family's going to do crazy stuff for you. So even though um, he's not doing what he needs to do as far as working, I think that the uncle puts up with more because he does realize that he has no one and that he lost his dad really young, lost his mom pretty young. I mean, he didn't took you care say of the it. uncle wasn't a fan of hers anyway. Right. No, he didn't like her from the get go. So, all right, let's see what else he says. If this man doesn't want to be live, stop asking him to go live as a matter of fact let me say this too jason i know that you have never really been given a legitimate opportunity to process everything that has happened in your life over the last um <laughs> right to be in to be in said he should have said i wipe you see that's the, the i was thinking he could have come out with a lot more like truth bombs and really shut her down but i think he's starting to maybe learn a little bit that when the cameras go off he's going to pay for everything he said mm -hmm. yep over the last uh one two three four five years or whatever let me on make here. sure she's not back okay home. i mean and again i understand it 
Everything has been happening super, super fast. And you haven't had the opportunity to, to, to really process all of these things. And I think it's wrong that she doesn't give you the opportunity to do that. Okay. Now, her mother is in the uh, title of this video, and I'm, I'm going to get to that in a minute. But I just wanted to talk to Jason real quick. Granted, he's he's upset with me. I am extremely upset with him and upset with uh, Shani. Shani makes this into a one-sided thing, acting like, I did everything. I didn't do nothing. She was the one who came on here and said that um that I gave her a death sentence to this very day. She has not acknowledged that whatsoever. Now, I want to get to her mother. Shani's mother was correct about everything that she said about her, and particularly about her being a lazy, fat slob that don't want to get off her behind and go do anything. Love that. And it's true. And I'm saying that unapologetically. Shani, you are a fat lazy slob that refuses to get off your behind and do anything i'm not I'm, listen to me i know a lot of people talking about g smacks and all other stuff and y'all want to get your jollies on and laugh that's fine but i'm talking directly to her because what she did to jason just run, uh, uh, uh in that previous video was wrong if the man doesn't want to sit on if the man don't want to be on social media stop making him come on social media like when Leave you guys are living in the house barracuda. and, 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 yeah, and you barracuda. just wake up in the morning and the first thing out of your mouth is a youtube event some people don't want to hear about that stuff early in the morning. Some people don't want to hear about that in the afternoon or the evening. You have a social media addiction that you need to get help for. Like, That's honestly. True. That's true. She is. Addicted. Everybody ain't into this the way you are. Give that man an opportunity to get the psychiatric help that he needs. If he needs to get around a doctor, another human being besides you, because my God, that would be good for him. I'm, I'm telling you, if one of you would just be nice and go over there and go visit him, he would spend hours talking to you about things that he actually cares about. He doesn't care about the things, well, not on the same level the way Shani does. Trust me, he is still a Republican. He still has Republican ideas. He still thinks that way. He can't express himself the way he wants because he's around her 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Mm -hmm. Like leave that I, guy alone. If he I doesn't want to be on social media, man wants to help Jason. But I think they're both irredeemable. I don't oh, think yeah. that they're going to change. I don't think they want to change. Jason has had opportunities to get help. I mean, I say, and he continues to to support. I mean, like just like after they had that fight or whatever, you know, he came back and then they they were eating pizza together. On the, but I will say, even though he took he he was acting like whatever, he. To me, his demeanor and shit nowadays, it's changing. Like he, I think he really is getting to a point where he is like, I don't think I can keep doing this much longer. He just yeah. looks, he looks like he has had all the life sucked out of him. And he's just like, I don't know. At the end of his rope, I'm worried. I actually am worried for him because I don't picture she threatens self-harm and things a lot and whatever. But I don't think she would ever actually do it. I'm not so sure about him. Oh, yeah. I think that he, I truly i can picture i could see in my head him on the news having gone crazy and done some mm -hmm. nutty Just shit lost his fucking mind you know yeah. media he doesn't have to be on social media because i think that's partly what happened with the kid yeah, they were sure. they were fighting and i'm not justifying it at all because he's fucked up for what he did and he deserved to be punished a lot more than he was. Oh, um, yeah. But I think that they start fighting. She's just bam, pecking and pecking and pecking and pushing and pushing and pushing and takes his Magic the Gathering cards, the one thing that he has left in the, his life because he's fucking sold everything else and lost everything else, and throws them all over the fucking room, throws a Cheeto bag of Cheeto chips at his head, because that's in the police report. She never brought that up or said anything about that when she told her story. She brought up throwing the cards. But she doesn't bring up throwing the Cheetos at his head and shit. And then he gets up to go out of the room. And instead of like going and blowing off steam somewhere on his own, he goes, sees the kids doing something that he doesn't like. And then that's and loses his cool because he's already so pissed at her. And it right. he's like, I'll show them both. Well, I don't even know if he thought that far into it. I think he walked out of the room. He sees the kid doing something that he's not supposed to be. And it just set him off because he was already at his breaking point. Yeah. 
and he take he you know so it, he ended up taking it out on the kid and he probably realized real quick afterwards what he did and like that he majorly fucked up but it was too late at that point you um, know what i mean cuz yeah, what had yeah. happened had happened and the the older son had already called the cops thank and god and it's just irritating thank god for that the- though because shanny wouldn't have called Nothing right. would have ha- nothing would have happened there. None of that would have even played out that way if it was left up to Shanny. Point this out You're in your right. chat. I noticed that you blocked me super quick. See, you don't want your audience to know that you lied. But don't worry, Shanny, because I'm not going to just be talking about this on this channel no more. No, 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 no. And people are going to question my motives for doing it. But it's how I'm going to do it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take this to another platform where I know that there's going to be more people watching besides, you know, what what I have on this channel, because I don't get that many viewers. Dragnet gets more viewers than I do, and a lot of these other people get more viewers. But I'm going to go somewhere where she's actually going to care. I'm going to try to um, contact Chafee the Eye and, um, and, 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 and somebody else who was close to Shani, um, and, like, maybe Rand Campbell and a couple of other people. And we're going to talk about this, because, like I said, what she's doing to him is wrong. And Jason, you was not wrong for saying, look, if you want to break up with me, break up with me. Because this man has hit rock bottom, and he just doesn't care anymore. Mm-hmm. And I don't think she gets it, and she understands it. First of all, myself and this audience can see the moment that somebody better comes along, he's done. Anyway. She will, can you imagine, though, if that happens, she will. Fu- she would probably end up killing some other chick. Or oh, him. Yeah. Or killing him. If, if he actually tried to leave. She would, there's no way in hell she would let that happen. I know that's the crazy thing is, like, they're talking about being soulmates and, uh, you know, such a great relationship and they've learned so much and they don't like all this shit. But as soon as they get in a fight and they were talking about how short the fight was, yeah, in a short fight, in a three minute fight, you already talk about, you should leave me. Right. I can't even imagine. I can't even imagine. And we don't ever, like, we have arguments every married car, every couple does, but we never threaten. But our arguments each other. aren't like that. Knock on wood. Our arguments aren't like that either. Like, no. um, well, I've learned the older I've got, like, it's not worth it to like get that upset. Like, cause true. Later, later on, you do feel guilty about, or you do realize like, oh, maybe I shouldn't have went that far. So it's like when you're starting, starting to get pissy and irritated with each other, it's better if you just fucking kind of go do something else, separate for a minute until you cool off and then all of a sudden what do you know 30 minutes later you're not that mad anymore and and it's over before it even begins. I, I mean when we were in high school i think we had stupid fights about stupid things when we were in our 20s we still got more heated but i think like when you're married and you know that neither of you are going anywhere you kind of pick your battles like is it really worth it because exactly exactly if it's not then you it's just not. let it go and if right. you're not if it's not something that's gonna like dissolve a marriage over then it can't be that important Right. And I know you and you know me. So, you know, when we're saying things like that, we're when we're just pissed up, pissy and being in a right. bad mood. And and you I know what I mean? That's a double edged sword, too, though, because once you know somebody that well, you know exactly how to like just pick them apart, like where to hit them to make them. Oh, and yeah. So if you're, if and I think that's, that far, what, she's, that's right, what she does. Right. Yeah, she right. definitely does. She knows what to say to make him feel the worst. And which you is know. you're not doing shit for me. Right. You won't work. You won't get a job, you know, but the thing that's fucked up about that too. And about her saying that is that she wouldn't fucking let him have a job. She doesn't trust him to be away from her for five fucking seconds. She wouldn't let him have a job working. She'd be too worried. He he would be flirting with girls and shit. Like she needs him by her side 24 seven. She doesn't really want him to get a job. You know, also she wants to keep doing exactly what they're, what they're doing, which is, nothing and then making him get on there and beg for money because she doesn't have to do the dirty work she makes him do it and right. that's oh, what yeah. she wants to keep happening that's exactly what she wants she just to sits off doing. camera and moans to right have for some a, a, yeah just tell him that i'm really sick and right. um, i'm dying and, she, and i think that she manipulates him and that too because i think he ch- genuinely de- believes that she is somewhat sick i, I don't think know if he, he thinks might. that she's as sick as maybe yeah. she says but i think that he does think that she's sort of sick and he and she knows that he lost his mom to cancer and shit so it's a weak spot for him she and plays she's on that yeah she's manipulating him with that you Another know because thing, and i don't know if i've uh i know that i, I can't remember where i heard it or where i've heard it said but like once divorce or breaking up once it has been brought up once you've like said it out loud then it's time it's, to just uh, well yeah because, because it's, now it's been brought up 
you're going to say you, it again. You know it's on your mind. They know it's on your mind. They know it's a possibility. Things change after that. I mean, it is a right. game changer. Well, and once you said it once, you'll say it again and right. again. It'll be easier the next time. And mm -hmm. then you'll go a little bit farther the next time. And I mean, right. once you've said it, once it has been made a possibility, it's yeah. over. Mm -hmm. Be good if you come to it. If I if I can get like you, uh, uh, Ran, if I can get like um, Brett and a couple of other people that she likes to talk about from her past, all of them will say the same thing. That if this man don't want to be on social media, he don't want to be on social media. Now, unfortunately, he's kind of made his bed, and a lot of you guys are going to tell him to sleep in it. But at the end of the day, I have enough empathy for the guy to know that if he doesn't want to be live, he doesn't want to be live. Like, 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 like I, I know a lot of you don't like me talking like this, but that's the type of toxic femi feminism that I absolutely <laughs> can't stand. I absolutely can't stand that mess. I absolutely loathe that. If this man doesn't want to be on social media, stop coercing him, conning co him, him, using him, manipulating him to be on social media. Stop it, Shani. If you want to be social media famous, then do it by yourself. Do it by yourself. If you want to be a beggar on the street, do it by yourself. She won't. You want to be pathetic, lousy, and lazy? And what's really fucked up is that if they ever did split up, right, she'll find some other guy to do this same shit. Yeah. I you mean, wouldn't think are... you wouldn't think that she would be able to or whatever, but there are like she's got there's other guys that want her right now. I mean, she's not lying about that. I've seen it. And I don't know if it's just guys that like big women. There's you idiots know, everywhere. But yeah, she would find she would find another one to do it. She would she would find there's a, at least another one other idiot out there that would put up with her bullshit. As do Teddy Bear can attest on your mama's house, there is a kink and a fetish for everything. People who like big women, stinky mm -hmm. women. I mean, Ew, like there is, I'm, I'm not I'm not even joking, babe. There was that's this obviously what Rev likes. <laughs> there was a uh thing on there. And a guy likes, um, like, after his wife works out. Yeah, you told me about that. Uh, he asks her not to bathe for, that's, like, days on end. Yeah. Because that's what he prefers. I mean, there. so there is, <laughs> there oh, is yeah. a person for, for, for every everything. freaking weird mm, situation. Yep. Mm. I mean, think about, like, a, like um, vomit fetish and stuff. If there's that, then. Oh, God. I don't even. Oh. Yeah. It's foul. Yeah. It's foul. So, yes, she can find somebody. Yeah. Not everybody wants to get on here and talk about this stuff. Not everybody wants to come on here and talk to people. Yes, he did. He looked very broken. I think he's getting sick and he's getting tired of her. And he's starting to understand, I think, a little bit that he can do better. He has no idea how much better he could be doing. He's going he's gonna to feel kind of silly when he finally walks away and he sees all the support he's going to get. I'm telling you, he, he's he's not going to be able to to deal with all of the support he's going to get. But um, Shani, you're you are a you are a monster. You are you you're one of them people that I want to see go to Jerry Springer and have them throw tomatoes. <laughs> I at forgot you. About like that. honestly, you're 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 that you're that despicable. You're honestly that despicable. If this man doesn't let, listen, if I was a non-believer, I'd be using different words, and I would be just, uh, describing a lot of this differently. But I can't. But it is absolutely driving me crazy watching her just destroy this man. It's just, it's just disgusting. And like I said, all I'm doing right now is showing empathy towards jason right now that's all i'm doing right now i have strong opinions about him as well and about some of his decision making regarding her they're not even supposed to be doing that stuff over there for what i understand oh here we go this is the part so a lot of you don't gotta wait for another eviction saga that's gonna be happening sooner than later if the uncle ever gets wind of what they're doing in that house mm. Mm Hmm. And I don't think she any gets it. I don't think she gets it. Winter starts, I believe, on the 20th.
I might. I might call the uncle and tell him about what's going on on Twitch. But tell the uncle to leave him alone and and, and let um let him see that um that that Shani's making him do it. But Shani, your mother. I'm sorry. I'm on your mother's side 100%. You convinced me when you <laughs> but, were living in the house that, that your mother was a monster and all this other stuff and whatnot. Love but, notes what? for TLC. Trashing us, lying us, cunt says when the uncle kicks them out, they're moving in with their best with her best friend, Carrie. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh, boy. That's, oh, that's hey. Yeah. Yeah. She... <laughs> No, there wouldn't be a fucking chance in hell. But also, that I'm the last person. She can't stand me. She cannot stand me. She's had a lot to say about now, me. I see what you, I see what she was talking about. I see what your mother was talking about. You ain't nothing but a user and an abuser. That's all you are. Rojo, they actually paid for that themselves. Uh, she got her first, I guess, Twitch check or whatever. And that's what they spent it on. Internet. Because of course that's what's most important to her. So, not food, but you're a, to get sad, that you're a sorry off. sack of trash that really, really, really needs to be taken care of. And I ain't talking about uh, 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 helping you get a roof over your head or nothing like that. Somebody needs to go upside your head, like honestly. Because <laughs> what you're doing is deplorable. I love that part. Right. Somebody needs to go upside it is your immoral. head. <laughs> Bug love it is immoral. It is immoral. Oh, is she? Let's see. Yep, she is. Let's see what she's saying. Hold up, guys. She ain't gonna say what happened. She'll be playing her stupid game. You think? The TV, then engage with the community. That's because people are fucking crazy, Lewis. Everything okay? Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Uh-oh. Just someone came over. Oh, it was the uncle, I guarantee yep. it. Yep. Show was. Somebody okay. in her chat needs to ask about the uncle. Because that's who the fuck it was. But listen to who me. Who else would show up over I there? I sound like an old fool. She's trying to play it off like nothing... Went Joe down Corporation so. has been she was gone for a while. The land, so there was a conversation that, a that was had. One hundred percent. Oh, Silence down. Ledge has a good idea. Silence Ledge said it could be a drug like, dealer, though. That's but possible I don't, too. But I think that if that were the case, then they would have had it planned. Yeah. But also, Jason would have just taken, you know, gone in the back room. It would have taken forty-five minutes. And... But also, she wouldn't have been like wondering who right. she was. It sounds like somebody's at the door. Yeah. I bet, I bet it was Lewis, the uncle. Yeah. It, that means if you buy a membership from JoJo Corporation, that building becomes fucking ugly. That's wrong. I hear mm -hmm. Jay. I hear Reb saying something. You want to do the community center. Hey, Sabella. Reasons. Well, we think uh, that the uncle yeah, just showed up. God. I will, mister. But she ain't said I will. anything exactly yet. That's good, actually. I love you. That turned out to be really good. Yeah? Yeah. You had to, I had to stir it up and get the ice. Milk. That's what you needed. You needed caffeine. Oh my they god, they went and spent again. more money. Yeah. <laughs> mm, what's this? I guess Vincent No wonder and they're Chaz they're broke. They're always gonna no be baby. broke. Yeah. Like that's fucking ridiculous. This place dude. is even more dilapidated than I remember. What? She's definitely high. Cause she is trying to be so happy go lucky and bullshit, like Right, trying to play. Someone it needs. Down. Someone What's needs to ask her. Like, Are so you you're not sick anymore. Apparently, right? No <laughs> more cancer. No more cancer happening. Your cancer cleared up. I'm seeing and hearing things. You saw something. Hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. That's what you saw. A rat. It wasn't a ghost or a demon or or 
A figment of your imagination, even. Yeah, they do get food stamps, but they're still mm. spending money on other shit. How much more Anytime, stupid can Billy. you be? He said thanks, Rev. Well, thank you. Ew, something, somebody's eating something because I hear it. It's not like he walked up to the gas station, probably. Now what? Uh, ah, the Junimo. You're worrying me, Lona. Why? Look, I think I'm going ahead. No, home. Melissa, no, you can't. I need yeah, you can't use EBT lunch. for DoorDash. Me too. You can't that's use what... it for prepared food, like deli that's and stuff like that. You can't lunch get. And dinner. Yeah, that's what's so fucked up about this. Is like they should be saving lunch. every money that they have for other shit and getting the food from the store because that's what they get help with. <laughs> you know, like that's what the food stamps are. My God. Second lunch. Cause I'm a nerd. Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can help catch that rat. You got timed out on her, Shaw? For asking her yeah, about the uncle? I'll catch that rat. Thanks, Lewis. Hi, maybe. Just someone came over. No biggies. Mm -hmm. Right. Then why won't you say who it was? Oh, you did, and she timed you I out for that. This. I guess <laughs> next Sunday we'll be <laughs> visiting. The that makes sense, Sean. Of the West, I guess. At least she didn't block We're you. We're off to see the wizard, the wonderful wizard of Stardew. Stardew. It's in an alien language that I do not know what it is. Mm. You like that? Oh, you got a sock you account? Yeah, I need right. to make a sock account to go in there on her and fuck with her. Or actually, oh I should just God. use your account, babe. Yeah. Try it again. What is your account? I I'll got a little scared come get it from you. how the stream ended. That's amazing. Yeah. Send me, yeah, send me the information or whatever, and I'll sign in on it and see if I can get her to talk to me. I'll, I'll try it's asking okay. some questions and shit. I'm fine. Wouldn't that be it funny if I'm able to, like, completely mm. troll her again? That is <laughs> so good. It's really Well, now you won't be able to because she'll see it, but it still would have been well, She don't know who I am, though. I She's got a bunch it. of people that go in there and talk. She's not smart enough to figure it out. I would say a bunch. Although this morning apparently she's figured out one person, I and I I'm pretty I sure I know who she's talking about. Well, that's because she sent him uh, something it's in worth PayPal. The hot bone, folks. I'm not gonna Probably know. apologizing. Again. <clears throat> it's Mayor Lewis's birthday. Mm, I think it, there's more hobby, to it than that. Hobby, darling, baby. I think it's somebody the else loner that's in cahoots with knows that. the doctor. Yeah. Yeah. That's how she figured lonely. it out. Okay, this is a plan. <laughs> I'm going to make another stream where I'm going to try my best to get in his pants and marry him, <coughs> cool. Dr. Javi, because he's a loner too. He's a loner. Yeah, but he's got money, so I figured what? I got a well successful farm and, and he has a well, you know, a, a well established medical facility. We would be such a bomb like power couple. Mm -hmm. What? Wow. She is fucking retarded. Well, eventually, like, you could open up a marijuana. Just shut the fuck up. Dispensary. He looks like he would. She's talking mm -hmm. about marijuana and shit in this game. Mm -hmm. Like, is she dumb? Yeah, she always says shit. Is Dr. So Harvey weird. would so smoke pot. No, was dreaming. Yeah. She's not good at that whole Hi, you know, English thing. He's struggling to make end meet. I don't have enough patience. I bet she doesn't even sound like she's talking to anybody in her chat. Uh, it, in any in any way. In it, there's only 12 people in her What's chat right now. Song? I don't have one. She has 12 people. 
That's not gonna be the. That's not gonna make before. her money like she thinks, is it? Hi, Pierre. No. All right. So... What's up? I'm here to buy shit. I want some seeds. Can I buy some seeds from you? All right. Let's buy a bunch of seeds. We'll buy twenty of these. Did you figure out your thing, babe? Trying now. Ten of these. We'll buy some of those. Ah! Foiled. I guess next week. You could just give me your phone, ding dong. We'll maybe get yeah. something going, yeah. I guess. But well, hold on, I'm, I'm just trying to figure out the password. Oh, oh George! In he's going to church. I need he to get my to phone charger every anyway. Every Sunday, that George fella here. That's a terrible gift. I didn't mean to give you a fucking gift. <laughs> That's a terrible gift. What dickwad? You know, here I am with a bunch of seeds and trying to conquer the world, and he's like, fuck you, bitch. Like, what's up with that shit? What an asshole. Shop. No, I don't want to shop. Oh, wait, I don't got money. I can't even do this. Fuck. Okay. Well, I guess we'll just go and... Give this dude a chicken. This is so boring. I think Can't Help Falling in Love With You is my favorite Elvis song. I can't help I think. falling in love with you. Yeah, that one. That one? I think that's my favorite. Yeah, I think I can help it. And I go to children. I don't know the lyrics. Hi, I'm back. <laughs> but I try to tell you that I have it all the way. I try to do it for you. My lovey poo. What is she doing? I love you. I love you. Oh shit. I, I love you. <laughs> I love you. Okay, sorry. I just came up with a song in my head and went for it. I know I do that a lot. Pleasant. I have music in my head. This little song's very right. I am. You're cute. You think I'm cute? Yeah, I think you're cute. Baby. <laughs> I do. You're sweet. I try to be. Yeah. But I get bitchy when I get hangry. I can't help that, man. I don't know what's fucking wrong with me. Blood sugar. Really? Yeah, I just hit the ground. But you, you get angry. Mm -hmm. Gunther. I get mega hangry. Remarkable. It's very old. I'd love to study this. <coughs> I don't know detail, how much of this I can. But it is yours. I don't know how much of this I can listen. To. This is stupid. Mm. Ladders. I think the brownie keeps getting stuck in it. Yeah, that I figured that would happen. So you take the top off and start eating it out of the top. You want me to eat the top? <laughs> yeah, you could do that. Yeah, I like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's pretty hot. Did he just say that was hot? That's what he said. Oh, y'all want to go back to G-Man? And finish what he was saying? I can do that. Is that what everybody wants? Anything but this. I want to see that so bad, right. bro. Let's go back to it then. I love you. I love you.
course you made the man shave his head for flirting, which you do almost every time you go live. Yep, with Octopus Prime. Shave your head. Mm-hmm. Talking about all this weight you losing. You ain't losing no weight. And you ain't got no <laughs> cancer. And you've been dying for the last six years, you liar. You liar. Anyway, I know some other people got live streams. I don't want to take from their streams. But um, I'm I'm just saying that... um. That 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 was disgusting. It was absolutely disgusting. And 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 how did how can you sit there, Shani, and be so puffed up and proud? And 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 Rev, how can you sit there and allow this woman to talk to you that way when, for the better part of three years, you was taking care of them with your with 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 you was taking care of them with what your mother left you or whatever. And now you guys are all looking forward for the EBT card. Do you not see the judgment hand of God on your life? That the Lord Jesus Christ is against you. He is not with you. And if you repent, he will bless you. But you got to get away from that devil. It's your life, dude. You can do whatever you want. But if you want real peace, dude, you got to come to know the Prince of Peace, and you and 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 you really got to get away from. Oh God, you you got to get away from Shannon. Mm -hmm. All she cares about is YouTube fame, dude. She don't care about you, and if she does care about you, it's only temporal until the next guy comes along. And Jason, I'm saying this because I care. Please do not go on your YouTube channel, G man. I don't want to hear it. You know you betrayed me. I would have never did what I did if you, I'm sorry, if your dumb behind woman didn't get on YouTube, G-Man gave me a death sentence and had all those <laughs> plots to try to have me give her back, the, to try to give you the house back under pity. The little plot that you guys had, the fraud that you guys had planned. So cut the baloney. You're hungry right now because of your woman. Mm-hmm. Because if I was in the picture, you wouldn't be hungry right now. You're getting what you deserve. And I'm telling you, dude, get away from her. And then the blessings are going to come and you ain't going to know what to do with them. But you're never going to see it until you take a step out on faith. You know it and I know it. That woman is not good for you. And like the rest of these people in this community, and listen to me, I want to publicly apologize to Dragnut. I want to apologize to Miss Parker. I want to apologize to Burntos. I want to apologize to 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 the Geek Room. I want to apologize to Sabella. I want to apologize to um to Carrie. I mm. want to apologize to 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 XX Archive XX. I want to apologize to um to uh I want to name him by name. I want to apologize to Draven's Crypt. I want to apologize to BGTV and anybody. I want to apologize to Indigo. I want to apologize to the Gentleman Pioneer. I want to apologize to Lubus. I want to apologize to Todd. I want to apologize to everybody I went after that was exposing this disgusting Neanderthal. <laughs> and I sat there and I defended her. Neanderthal. I apologize to that. I mean, I, I apologize to the people that I was attacking. Regarding that, because this woman is everything that you guys said she was. Rev, get away from her, man. She's destroying you. And I don't want to end up hearing about you dying, dude, behind this. this and believe me, if it happens, Shani, the same thing I told these other people, I'm telling you, I will testify in court against you. And I'm not playing. Nothing better happen to that dude. All right, let's see That's what these... Yep. Back She's talking about COVID now. It's different still. Like your tongue is numb on like a constant basis or something. Her whole tongue? I know, right? <laughs> I know, right? Queen of Spade, that ain't oh. all he does. He's not a very good person. The migraine that comes with this. You know what we should watch? What? Today. God, I hate it when he burps. It's so gross. Oh, okay. We should watch Mike Matai do all of fucking Red Dead. If that's what you want to do. Yeah, bro. I, I, I'm very happy that you want to watch Mike. 
I never got it, never caught it. Luckies. Oh God. Lucky. She's so boring with this shit. I'm gonna pull I up something else to watch. Let me Lucky. see. Lucky. Let's see here. Wanna do another round of trivia? Um, no. yeah. I wanna watch something different though. Hold on. The next thing I need is 75 wood. There's one that I, I want to show you that you haven't seen. I, don't I right, can't I do it. it. Never mind. Oh, you've got it figured out? Oh. I'll just work on my fucking Let me farm. See. Let me see this real quick. Oh, like. Alright. <clears throat> Get over here, you son of a bitch. One second, guys. I'm looking, pulling something up here. <clears throat> Praise God, I'm in remission. Okay, Praise God. Really quick. That's great. She anyway went from having cancer to in remission cool. in the same day. Is being in remission? Yeah. That's gotta be like the best day ever feeling. You know when SpongeBob is like, it's the best day ever. Please don't sing. This is the worst. Right? Hold on, I'm about to pull up something for us to watch, babe. I just wanted to put this in real quick. And see if it works. Okay, I wanted to put the green beans back here. Green beans to be put in the back. One second, guys. <clears throat> We're gonna watch something different in just a minute. It sounds like Shani's walking. <laughs> 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 All right, I'm in there now. <clears throat> what should I say? Soon Give me some, let me think of this. Let me think about this really quick. <clears throat> hey, oh, she, I might not be able to nice. say anything because she might have it set where you have to have been Definitely. doing stuff for longer to um, say anything. Now we need five cauliflower. Say was Jason's uncle just visiting? I think somebody already asked that. What, There's didn't they? weird sounds. I will in a minute. Today, Hold on. I'm not am I just make, getting paranoid and shit? The cat's eating. Oh, that's what it is. <laughs> Holy crap! I'm gonna pull up that was up this kid. video. Really I quick thought there was. Too, yeah. <laughs> I want Michael to see this. I swear to God, honey. My imagination's getting the best of me today, man. Yeah, I get that stuff too. We're okay, Great Scots. How are you? Did you just hear? You? Yeah. Man, Great Scots Diner. Remember that? Oh my god, oh. dude. Oh my god. So good. That was awesome. <clears throat> we are like Dank and Dabby. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I say we do the Dank and Dabby show, just redo it. Why That's, isn't this pulling up? Hold on a second, guys. Oh, now it's going. Oh! Tell you the truth, I am like obsessed with wanting to watch uh, Deep Space Nine, I'll be honest. Yeah, it's a great show. Are you obsessed with that too? 
Uh, obsessed? I don't know about that. Yeah. I can get obsessed with it, though. It's a very good show. Well, I'm almost done with Sunday work, so... Here on the farm. Uh-oh, they're about to watch a movie or that something. That was my main intention, is, like, doing this game and taking Ew. it to Sunday and then I hate it when going they... off stream and then watching something with you and... They're about to get off but stream. But it's almost done. Holy crap. Oh, ooh, ooh, oh. Look at that beautiful gem right there. All right. Like, how big do you I'm going to pull this, this one up, and then... Would you guys like to watch something different? Or would you like to keep watching her play this game until she gets out. off? If you want to keep watching this, press 1. If you want to watch something different, press 2. I guess we'll find out I've on got, the next I've got a stream, a stream that she did that I think you, you know, guys would find Valley. interesting. You know? How far did Shani get on her off time while she's watching, <clears throat> you know, Deep Space Nine? We're going to find out on that, folks. Like, this definitely, this area needs a path. <laughs> Alright. Looks like it's going to be watch something else. I'm going so to keep an I'm eye on... While I'm off stream, is I'm going to try to eliminate all these trees, all the stones, and keep working on this garden while doing the Sunday challenge today, and I'll show you how far Why I does get she keep saying Sunday? Does she think tomorrow. it's Sunday? No, so she's worked, like, she's, the game is in Saturday, so if she plays through I'm the whole Stardew day Valley. of Saturday and Stardew, it'll move Me, over to Sunday I'm, so then I'm she can stop out. playing. I have to, in you know what I mean? probably yeah. two hours, I will be getting a message from the boyos to do a certain something with them. So... I'm taking off. I watch some Deep Space Nine. Watch some Deep Space Nine too. We're on the fourth season. Start watching the fourth season, and we could talk about it. So peace, Maranatha, guys. I will be on a little later, and it'll be a talking stream, not a gaming stream. Bye, guys. Bye, bitch. All right. <clears throat> Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna we're gonna watch this um older stream and then i'm gonna wrap this up and then if she comes back on later i will come back if she comes back on later and does do a talking stream not a gaming stream then i'll pull i'll cover that if she comes back on doing another gaming stream there's no point really because it's boring nobody wants to see that shit sound good guys and sounds great not too long all right you haven't seen this one i don't think babe this is uh I, and let me go ahead and give a trigger warning for this because she does say some pretty offensive shit in this stream. Just know that if you're if you're offended by stuff easily, um, racism and shit like that, you don't want to watch this. You want to check it out. If not, here we go because she uh, she really puts on a show here for you guys. That comes with being a fucking female. Um, you know, how can I put this? Pause it real quick. Somebody asked I what Maranatha means. I find it means. really. Mm -hmm. Somebody asked what Maranatha means, and it is Aramaic and means our Lord has come. Mm -hmm. Well, that makes no sense. Peace and our Lord has come. That's what she says? Yep. That's stupid. It's fucking weird how people can speak collectively for each other. They're always like, well, we feel this and we feel this. And I'm like, you sound like a goddamn cult member. I don't give a fuck what we fucking think and we isn't that terrifying? Look at God, her face. God, dog, yeah.
That is looks like that dog with those eyes. Scary. Like holy shit. Back the fuck off the camera a little bit and God. We fucking feel. Cause I'm not a we person. I'm an I person. I'm an individual person. Yeah. You are. I believe in individuality. I believe in thinking for oneself. And when I see the term, and when I see people say, we feel and we think, I'm like, who the fuck are you to tell people how they think and feel, first of all? And who is this we that you're speaking of? Just because you feel a certain matter doesn't mean all other people feel the same fucking way, dude. You sound like a fucking cult member when you come to me with these fucking we statements. And it's fucking creepy as hell. Because you're talking about my own personal yes, life. she did. She sure did. While doing these we statements, like you have some kind of fucking control over a motherfucker's life. Fuck your we. Fuck your collective brainwash cult fucking thinking your mob mentality thinking fuck that shit Oops. she thinks she's so tough man like i hate i hate her smugness i'm yeah. an individual i believe in individuality i believe in thinking for oneself and when you come to me and you give me we think this we think that i'm automatically gonna assume you're my, my, my motherfucking enemy because if you were my fucking friend, you would know how much I value thinking for oneself and individuality. You would think- And this is coming from someone who literally called their YouTube channel The Cult of Shanny. I think if you were my friend, you would know that. But I never saw your name before. I don't know who the fuck you are and you're using we statements to me like it somehow has to apply to my fucking life and I'm supposed to fucking deal with that shit. Like, just because it's we, I have to do what you fucking have Hold to on tell a second, me babe. to Let do? me write down this adult dating fuck site you. Uh, URL. Shut the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> fuck you. And I know there's a lot of people out there that's been getting these, well, we think this. I don't give a fuck what we think. I don't give a fuck what mob mentality brainwash cult members have to fucking think, frankly. Why do you think I'm not in Christianity anymore? Why do you think I quit that fucking dumb fucking religion? <laughs> Why do you so think angry. I quit it? It wasn't Jesus. I love Jesus with all my heart and soul, mind and body. I love Jesus. But Christianity, that fucking religion. Yeah, I agree. All it is is that we statement too, that cult like mentality. You gotta be like this, you gotta be like this, and if Why? you're not, we're gonna shun you from society. Yeah. Fuck you for that. I agree. Fuck. You need to screenshot that big eyed thing. I was saved yeah. 10 fucking years ago. 10 years ago, I was saved by wow. Jesus Christ. Not by Christians, but by Jesus Christ, I was saved. 10 years ago, she had that's and the whole time I was saying, I hate bringing up my faith, incredible. talking about love, talking about grace, talking about forgiveness, the whole time, because I actually know um, what the faith This was from a couple of months ago. This was from um, June 2022. It's actually about Absolutely. not a whole set of it's rules. Right, right around the time she lost, she got lost custody of the kids and they went into foster care. Wow. That's not what the Bible should have been about. It's not a rule book. It's a book to show you how to love others as yourself and to love God and to know how to treat people with kindness and respect. That's what the Bible should have been about. But it was twisted, turned into this rule book of you can't do this, you can't do that, you're going to go to hell, you're going to do this. The only people that went to hell in the Bible are those who did not love others. How do you know? What, what are you God about? spit them right That's out of their true. fucking mouth, his mouth, just like screw you, motherfucker. It's not true at all. <laughs> so, these people don't. are the worst. Yeah, who made that a rule book? Yeah. Don't come to me. World. Yeah. With this, these we statements. These we 
Don't thing. come to me with this cult like thinking. Unless the we statement me is and tell we think me I'm supposed to do Shani. what you yeah, tell or me to do. Or we're sending you money. I'm supposed to be the way you want me to do. I am going through a lot right now, okay? I'm going through a lot in my life. And I don't need people coming to me with their we statements telling me what their whole collective thinks I should do. Fuck your call. I'm not part of your fucking cults. I am not part of your fucking cult. I do nope. not have to, have to not. adhere to your fucking cult. <laughs> Hi, Michelle. I, 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 I hate we statements. We think this. We think that. Do you know that's a form of manipulation by doing that? Because what you're doing by saying we think you should do this is you think that is you're putting someone into an isolated position where they feel like there's no choice but to follow other people in order to feel like they should be accepted. Fuck you. I don't need to feel accepted into oh, anything. That's true. I don't. I don't want to be accepted into any fucking like we call fucking shit. We call fucking shit. I don't. Because I think for myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think for myself. You don't think for yourself because you use we, we statements. We think you should do this. We think you should do that. You're a lemon. You're a cult member. You're brainwashed. A My lemon? dad's a pastor. It, it's proof and you're brainwashed when you use we. One of the things huh? he says is people try to make God change for them instead of changing for God. And that's exactly what they do. Right. Oh, yeah. 100% think you should do this we think you should do this that's cult like thinking you can't think for yourself you can't come to me with well i think honey you can't you can't say i think you say we think who's we give me specifics who we is who's Everyone, we the world. and why should i give a fuck about we and why should i listen to we Do you think just because it's some fucking collective they have any more meaning and any more truth than I do? It's most likely if you're in a collective with mob right, mentality Chelsea. thinking, you're probably not thinking correctly and you're probably getting the facts all skewed up Hi, like Millie. the game of telephone. Like the game of telephone. Hi, Millie. That's why you label communication from person to person. Not person to a collective fucking group who thinks they can fucking control you like a goddamn cult. Scientology? Oh my god, <laughs> shut I mean, up. I don't give a fuck what it is. I don't give a fuck what give it is. Oh, oh, I forgot. Listen to this because she's about to snap at Rev big time. <clears throat> Scientology? I don't give a fuck what it is. I don't give a fuck what it is. Churchy. Can I please speak? Biz, <laughs> uh, that's all you do is he, speak. He tries to say one thing. Can I please speak? That's all the bitch does. I'm not doing good. Okay? But it's okay to say you're not good. It's okay to say you're not good. It's okay to be going through a lot of fucking stress. A lot of fucking things are happening to me that you don't even fucking know. You're losing your kids. We do. You know, know I don't put all my business out on blast. Yeah, oh, shit. Are you kidding yeah, me? Yeah, the fuck you do. But I, like, I'm really tired of these wee statements. Who cares? I'm really tired of this collective fucking thinking thing, because I don't, I don't think people should think collectively like that. I don't think people should think like other people. I think people should think the way they want to think and how they should think unless and how their the, brain is wired for them to think. Unless they're disagreeing with you. Right. How about that? Individuality, not some fucking collective cult shit. That's how I feel. Because I look at collective cult shit and I know they're not going the right path. I know. And whoever the fucking leaders are of that, they're out to fucking get my ass. Because they're trying to tell yeah. me what the fuck to do and try to run my fucking life. No. 
I'm not going to have fucking strangers on the internet dictate how my life should be, frankly. She needs to pull and that's not me being, me and being defensive. That's me being fucking real. And I say that to everyone yeah. else. Do not let fucking people, strangers on the internet, dictate how you think about others or think about a scenario or whatever. Think for your fucking self. Stop this I do. collective. So everyone we think me. this and we think that. Do you have a thought of your own? I don't give a fuck what we thinks. I'm not we. I'm me. But let me say that again. I'm not we. I am me. Repeat to yourself. I am not we, I am me. Then wouldn't we be doing a we thing? If we were Imagine how miserable you? your fucking life is because you think you have to go in upheld to a fucking collective Damn, thinking. Damn, the sex bots are on it today. That's got to be some miserable ass thinking. I wonder if it's because I made a membership. That's got to be some <laughs> codependent <laughs> fucking thinking. Certainly not independent thinking. It's certainly not thinking out of the box thinking. And frankly, I think people who follow people like that have a low intelligence. When people use about these statements, low second. intelligence. Mm -hmm. They must have been going through the modern day education system. Because they think just because you think collectively you are right. But you can't be right about someone's life when you're not fucking in it and you are not don't know them and you don't know anything about them other than what is said on the internet. And That's the most stupidest fucking thing. Should I say that I know Kim stupid. Kardashian and I should tell her what the fuck she should do with her life because I see her every day on Instagram? Should I start barking orders at, at, at Kim Kardashian? Or or, or Britney Spears or right. Madonna or oh, yeah. all the other plethora of fucking celebrities that are on the internet. Should I start barking artists and be like, well, we think you shouldn't be with Pete Davidson, Kim. We think you shouldn't. You don't think she got okay? that every fucking day. We think mm -hmm. you should do something different with your life. It's called ignoring it. Like, just ignore it. Right. If you don't we think it. you should go and do... And and, and and be lonely and isolated for the for your whole entire life. And we will tell you how to think, feel, and and, and decide your decisions in your life. Look at this bitch's face. We <laughs> like holy shit. Those she eyes. Like a, she looks like a big grouper or something. Like those eyes are bugging. We out of her know head. better. We. Dude, you know what was that guy who like was talking almost like a cartoon? He's like, kill him. Wow. What was that? Oh guy? yeah, that Nick Bravo guy. Her voice was kind of sound like his. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> Vomit. Vomit. Because see, Blech. the people who I Blech. value on the internet, the people who I love on the internet, they're individuals. They don't, they don't think like everyone else. Okay? They, they don't feel the need to follow a crowd. Right. <laughs> Do you know what happens to people who follow them, follow crowds? Listen to this shit. Just wait. I could tell you a story about what happened during World War II, but unfortunately, I can't say the motherfucker's name without getting a community guideline strike or something like that. But there was a time where there was this huge group of people in the Germany area, and they decided to follow a dictator. You know who she's talking about, right? Yeah, babe. I did win the trivia, just so you know. Because they followed said dude, people openly and willingly walked into ovens. Wait, what? Willingly? Openly, openly and willingly walked into the ovens. I don't remember it happening like that. No shit. Can you be a little more anti-Semitic? She is the fucking worst. 
People openly and willingly walked into ovens. Because they were going with the collective. They were walking with everyone else. They just let that stuff happen. They just let it happen. Oh my god! They just dude. walked right into it. You no, know, they weren't being held against their will. They weren't being forced at gunpoint, physically right. made to like a fuck Star her, dude. starve to death. Lied to. They followed. No, they were just willing. They were just Man. following the cult. They followed. They weren't their own leaders. But they followed like little fucking sheep, little brainwashed sheep. Do, 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 do. Oh no, we're burning! And then, you know, that's the end of that. That's the end of that. Because they had the same mentality of collective thinking. See, they thought, uh, uh, well, if people are doing this, then I Why should do it not too. Kicked I This is not right. No shit. If they're going to this one Just area, wait. We... She gets even more mean in a second. Listen, probably should follow them. Ba ba ba. The whole time you were being lead, You're so weird led by funny. a fucking wolf, and you didn't even know it. That's what happens to people who follow. She literally just made that noise like a sheep. Uh, to people who died in the Holocaust. Wow. Like, wow, bro. Not a good look. My life. people, though, they don't fucking follow. My people, though, she has people. My people, they have a mind of their own. My people will argue with me if they think I'm in the wrong. Oh, really? But at the same time, they'll give me enough space for me to think it out and also give me enough grace and mercy. If I do what they don't want me to do, they're fine with it because that's what friends actually do. Bullshit. No, the fuck it's They don't not. do this conditional love fucking collective bullshit that collectives like doing. Well, if you don't follow our rules, you don't belong in anywhere near us. And we're Right, gonna... if you don't follow, as a person, if you are going to abuse your child, I want nothing to do with you. If you want to say that's the rules collective of society. thinking, if you want to say that's collective thinking because everybody, you know, is uh, against child abuse, then yeah, you're right. We, we're all in a collective group, and right. we don't like you. If you don't follow the rules of society, you are segregated from society in prison right. or some other way. But she also said that if they, they, they will say something to her, if she's doing something they don't like, bullshit. We say something to you, Shani, and you'll block somebody. If anybody disagrees right. with something you're doing at all, you fucking block them. Don't give me that bullshit. Destroy every fiber of your being because you didn't listen to us. I mean, she thinks she is witty as fuck. Well, she's like, yeah. I just nailed that. Oh, yeah. Are you offended that I completely am disgusted by we statements? No. I could and us shit. statements? You do realize that absolutely disgusts me when I see a, a, a person an individual who lacks thinking for themselves coming to me and saying we think this you're fucking brainwashed cult member thank you very much what makes you think just because you're part of that group I have to be part of that group and I have to do what the group tells me to do we don't, we don't I'm not a brainwashed you sheep like you I'm my own person, and I'm going to be my own person, and I'm not going to think like everyone else. Just because a group says think this way doesn't mean I have to, and and, and I, I apply it to all of you. You don't have to listen to a goddamn person if they're trying to do these we statements. Think collectively like us. No. No, I'm not a fucking Borg. A what? I'm not a bee. I'm not a drone. Character from Star Trek. I'm not an ant. I'm not an insect in any way. Why would I have collective thinking if I'm not an You're insect? You're a parasite. That's if I'm not are. a drone, if I'm not a Borg. Why, what purpose is there to listen to said people? A group of people. 
And, and why is the group of people so concerned over my own fucking choices and life decisions? Because they affect other people, not just why you. Why do you want to have so much control over my life? Because you're abusing children. And they want to help the a, children. a true thing. People change their minds. People find different reasons. People, people, some people out there like me want to keep someone alive from killing themselves. So they keep them in their life so they don't kill themselves. You know who she's talking Even about, right? may not be. No. She's talking about Rev. Because this is right when she took Rev back. And everybody was saying, you took oh, your yeah, child yeah. abuser back. Be the best for them, but they do and it. And her because excuse they was, "Oh well, if I didn't, he was gonna kill himself. So I have, I must take him back." Like no, bitch. Jeez. Love the person. That's and what that's some not why she took do. him back anyway. It wouldn't be right to do regardless. But that is isn't the truth anyway. She that's took what him some back people do. I don't know. Right. No, that's but not, don't I mean, come that, to me with wee statements. It's because he's so good in bed. Don't come to me with collective thinking statements. Because to me, when I say, we think this, it sounds like you're talking behind my fucking back. We are. We are talking yeah. behind your back. It sounds like you're talking behind my fucking back. You couldn't In talk to front, my fucking face. Back, you have to talk to my back, talk behind my back about my own fucking life and then use a we statement? We think this. Who the fuck are you to talk behind my back? You're not my friend. If you're talking behind my back, you are not my friend. <laughs> Nobody wants to be your friend. If you're talking behind my back trying to decide what I should do with my own fucking life, you are not my fucking friend. You are a controlling, brainwashed fucking sheeple who is a cult member in some way, shape, or form. You certainly are not my friend. Don't if you try me. to tell me what to do with my life, you are not my friend. If you if if you come to me with the we statements, you are not my friend. Okay, let's just get. I I don't have a lot of friends. Nope, you and sure don't. And the people who I do have friends, I value. And those people who fake to be my friends, as soon as I find out they're faking, I I I'm like, what is that? I met someone. One minute. Hold on, let me fast forward through this part where she's just off camera. Ugh, sorry about that. Wait. What were you we talking about? Oh, yeah. This stupid thing that people do called we statements. I'm so sick of people coming to me and being like, well, we think this, and that should mean... I'm what so to me? People coming to me? Because you're talking Man, behind my back and 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 and, and trying to decide what I, I should do with food. my fucking life. Are you my masters? We are if we're paying your way. Babe. Are you my masters? You collective ass thinking cult members. We Pretty think much. you should do this. Right. We think you should do that. If you want money we... from us, you do this. Period. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't know how else to... Fucking ants. It's about to get good. <laughs> and yeah, I'm very angry in the world right now. I'm a very angry individual, and I don't care if I'm angry. Because my anger is fully fucking justified at this point. In every single way. Do you know who she's about to talk about? No, you have to give me a second. I'm gonna, I'll be right back. Where did he go? What is he doing? Hold on one second, guys. <clears throat> yeah, I thought that's what he said too, Auntie. Let me go back to that. You fucking ants. And yeah, I'm vacant. I, I, I'm like, what is that? I met someone. I met someone. 
be my friends. As soon as I find out they're faking, I, I, I'm like, what is that? I met someone. I met someone. One minute. Wonder if it was like a drug dealer or something. You know he went I'm telling her about a girl. And, 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 and trying to decide what I should do with my fucking... Because my anger is fully fucking justified at this point. In every single way. In every single way. My anger is so justified toward everyone. Because I... What? Go ahead. Just hurry up. Shut your I've done my best to be the nicest, sweetest, kind... Hold on, guys. He's coming back. Say what? Say what? It's all, right. all in the family. All right. Be quiet so you can hear Sorry, this. I thought Rev's uncle was here. Shut up. <laughs> this gentlest, most understanding motherfucker out there. Lay down. But I've been stabbed in the back and been walked all over and been treated like absolute garbage for showing the best of my humanity that I could show people. So why should I not be angry at people? Why should I not, like, hold an offense toward people if I was trying my best and it still wasn't fucking good enough for people? Your best is not and good I was enough. given my best. I was given 250 fucking percent going over. Do you think he really thinks that? Yes. Yeah. Just listen you to what think she that said. She is trying hard as fuck. She's like, yes. I am putting out. That's what she over thinks. Twice as much as I should have to. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Listen. She's listen. never going to make it. Listen to what she says. For other people. For other people. Just for that other people to stab me in the fucking back. You know what really got me angry? I'll be honest. What really got me angry is what fucking Carrie did. Uh, that I really got learn. me fucking angry. I told you. <clears throat> you know what really got me angry? I'll be honest. What really got me angry is what fucking Carrie did. That really got me fucking angry because I thought, oh my god. Maybe I'm someone who actually cares for me and actually is going to be my friend. You did, bitch. But no, she was a fucking fraud like every fucking else. And so were you. You didn't do what you said. And the level of emotional and mental abuse I've gotten from people pretending to be my friends and pretending that they actually care for me just to pull the wool over my eyes and just be like, no, I never liked you from the beginning. It hurts so fucking bad. And I never said that to her either, by the way. Yeah. I didn't. Ne I never said, oh, I didn't like you from the beginning. I didn't ever say, oh, I'm faking being your friend. I explained to her, and she admits this now. Oh, hold on one second. We got a super chat from Buck. Thank you, Buck. Buck. Melanoma, huh? He said 20, uh, 250 forking percent. <laughs> 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 That's how much she gave. 250 forking percent. Um, but like, she she admits it now because just the other day she said, "Oh, I've never had a friend uh, that that uh, didn't want to be person who didn't want to be my friend because I had sex with my husband." Yeah, that like which that isn't even completely true either. But I wasn't faking it. You you said this guy almost killed your kid. You and weren't going to be, be with a him. Shitty parent if you took him back and that your and, kids were terrified of him. Right, and told me all of this shit only. For then the day he gets out of jail to go and sleep with him five seconds after he gets out of jail. Yeah. And I said, I, I cannot support that. Like, I will not support that. That's child abuse. What you guys are doing to those kids is fucking child abuse. Right. But while she was acting like she was going to change, do things different, get him out of there and do the best for her kids, you were willing it to. It was bullshit. Right. If she least... was going to. 
right talk I and was, be that you know i was willing to i was willing to hear her out give her a chance right. as a person but of course everything that she was saying was not true right exactly so why shouldn't I be angry at people over going through it over and over again? <laughs> oh. oh God! Why shouldn't I trust anyone? Why should I trust anyone? Don't. I don't give up. If you give people you all your fucking love and all they do with your love is they just fucking get be irresponsible with it. If she gives giving to her you around, like and she gave you all her love. And she's right. failing at life, and she if she wants to giving her if questions. she wants to bring up being irresponsible with who <laughs> she who she gives love and shit, she needs to look inward because she's giving love to the person who literally physically assaulted her kid right. instead of her kid. Instead of loving her kid and putting him first, she's putting her boyfriend first. So yeah, practice what you preach, Shani. You're nothing. Cause when I love, I love hard. <laughs> and you notice oh, she's God. not, she's never cried like this about losing her kids. No, she cries oh. about internet friends. Yeah. That's pathetic. And just in a second, Rev's about to walk out. So be watching for that. Cause he, he gets to a point where he just can't take it anymore <laughs> and, and stands up and he's like, I'm, I gotta get fucking out of here. And when I love, I love true and genuinely. I can't fake it with people. I can't fake being kind to people. I don't know how you fucking people can do that. If you fake to be someone's friend just to fucking hurt them. How can you do that to someone? I don't know how you can look in the mirror in the morning for doing that to someone. How can you look in the mirror when you abuse your kids and neglect them and they're fucking starving to death and no and shit. you and their abuser comes back in the house and you go fuck him in the next room while your kids are crying and shit? How do you look in the mirror? How do you wake up and look in the mirror doing nothing with your life, not trying, not trying to better yourself, being a lazy piece of shit drain on society? Right. If she can look in the mirror without a problem, then I don't know why she surprised anyone else. I can. just don't understand it. No, you don't understand being a good parent. And That's if I'm mad understand. at you, there's a damn good reason why I'm mad at you. I don't get mad at people just to Oh, thanks, Buck. Buck says, can you imagine what fake Shanny would be like? Oh, God. <laughs> Yeah, if this is real Shanny, fake Shanny. Oh, scary. Thanks, Buck, for the super chat. I appreciate that. Just stay that. mad at people. I'm mad at people because they harm me and they harm the ones I love. That's why I'm mad at people. Wait, what? Right. No, you're not. Or you'd be mad at that motherfucker sitting next to you right now. Or she just said that she doesn't that's, love her kids because Rev harmed her kid, you dumb bitch. That's what I'm saying. That's why I'm mad. Because I'm so disappointed in mankind. How can me, someone has borderline personality disorder oh and constant God. fucking chronic, severe fucking pain. Severe pain. How can I, I don't believe her about any of this shit. present no. the best? Not at all. And I believe she does have some pain, but I think it's self-induced, not just because she's right. overweight. I'm not I'm not fat shaming her. Don't, don't get me right. It's not just because of that. It's part it's partly because she's overweight. But the other part is the lack of exercise, the, the lack of getting up and getting around and doing things. If you're going to if you stay in that kind of lifestyle where you're overweight, you're not moving around. Then, yeah, of course, when you get up and start trying to move around, it's going to fucking hurt. But why has it got to be fat shaming? Like, where does fat shaming begin and pointing out the obvious end? I, I mean, I don't know where that um, line is. Well, I I'm guess... I'm not whole, fat shaming her. She's big. Uh, I mean, she's huge. She's right. Yeah. Gigantic. I guess I guess my whole thing with it is there's, a, there's plenty of shit about her personality and her actions that make her horrible that 
fat really doesn't even need to be on the on the list of bad things. You know what I mean? It's like no, yeah, but it is a she certainly is a factor in her pain, her ailments, her bullshit. Um, there are people uh, as big or bigger than her who are active, have jobs, keep their shit together. I mean, yeah, uh, do all the shit she says she can't do. Well, that's the um, thing too. She gives bigger people a bad name because there, there are. I mean, there's a lot of overweight people in this world, and a lot of them still work and do what they need to oh, do. Yeah, you kidding me? Like, like, ser- like, get around. Like, seriously, like, get around like anybody else or better. I mean, right? She uses just like she gives in a crutch. Just like she gives Christians a bad name. Just like she gives the mentally ill a bad yep. name. She gives bigger people a bad name as well. She gives us former people models a and bad treat name. People. She gives moms a bad name. She gives daughters a bad name. Sisters a bad name. Just people in general. She gives us a bad name. Respect. How can I do that? And you healthy fucking people can't fucking do that. I've never faked being someone's friend. Watch Red. Never. Never. Get up. I don't know how someone can do it. Do you have no feelings? Do you have no feelings of attachment with people? Not with you. Like, how do you do that? How can you fake being someone's friend? You act like you do with your other And then you come to me with wee statements. Talking behind my back like you fucking own me. I'm not your goddamn slave. <laughs> you're screaming, bitch. I can't like, handle you're, it. You're screaming. I can't do it. Now listen to what she says about him. I'm not your slave. And I get no empathy from that man. <laughs> None. Well, you want to be with him so bad. I get lied to. I get treated with disrespect. Well, you want to be with him. I get no comfort. No joy. No love. And people, for some reason, want me to feel normal, act normal, and behave normal when everything and everyone just doesn't give a fuck about me truly and doesn't actually want the best for me. Most people in this world want the very worst for me for no fucking reason other than they don't like me and I don't even know why they don't like me. Oh, sure you do. I told you why we don't like you. Because a lot of these fucking people I've given my time and money to You've given me neither. I put actual fucking effort. No. Into what? But can you expect other people for giving you fucking effort to forgive an effort to you? No. What Do you think someone's actually gonna help about? you? No. Do you think someone's gonna be there for you, hold your hand, and help you vent and understand the life? No. I am all alone in this world. I am alone. So is everybody. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So you can have your collective we. We. I'm alone. With no support, really, from anyone. So don't come to me and do the fucking we statements when you just want to control me and you don't even fucking support me. (laughs) So you can control me. And I don't mean financial support. I mean emotional support. Oh, you want both. Oh, yeah. I don't see people going in my DMs asking me if you're okay. Oh my Are you God. okay? I don't see I don't people care. doing that. I see people going in my DMs and telling me how I should live my life and how I should think. And people just yelling at me and telling me I'm a bad mother and telling me I'm you a this bad, horrible person. And it's like, <laughs> I do everything for everyone and I don't do anything for myself. You're oh delusional. My God. Fucking delusional. 
<laughs> and even if I do everything for everyone, it still isn't good enough for them. They'll still find a way to fucking hate me and bitch and complain about me. Well, when you actually do something for someone, then you can bring that up. But so far, you ain't done it yet. <laughs> she works her ass off. Who worked my I'm ass not off? loved and I have no one. And I have to deal with all of this shit myself, like always. <laughs> and You're an I'm, adult. I'm just gonna be right, honest, wild, I'm girl, really tired wild. with dealing shit on my own. Because I don't think I can do it anymore alone. <laughs> but I'm forced to. <laughs> I'm forced to. You know, you just, you show this unbelievable kindness and forgiven and mercy toward people and they'll still spit in your fucking face. They'll still call you names. They'll still degrade you as a person. I mean, she really thinks she is busting her ass. Mm -hmm. Oh, she believes it. I know how Jesus feels. Oh my god. I know how Jesus feels so I much. Forgot I know about how that. Jesus feels when it comes to that shit. She oh knows how god. Jesus feels. To have all the people that you love She's talking about Jesus you from the rule book? You. <laughs> over and over and over and over again. You know how heartbreaking it is to know that I have no one to emotionally support me? You're an adult. <laughs> the fuck do you think? That everyone wants Man. me to take care of them, but no one wants to take Who care of me. Who wants you to take care of them except your kids? No one takes care of her. And this is, this is a curse of a woman. <laughs> oh my god. This is the curse of a woman. It really is. You know, where the woman is expected to do be the super fucking person. It's just superhero mom shit. <laughs> but when you need someone, when you truly need someone, no one's there for you. They just ditch you. And that's what I am. I'm well, fucking ditched instead of being mom. heard. Mm -hmm. I'm fucking ditched instead of being heard. I'm fucking degraded as a person instead of being raised up. Oh my god. You raised me up. Like I'm so <laughs> torn up at, at, at my personage. My personage. What? Because my I'm no, I'm nothing like anyone tries to say I am. Right, we're all wrong. Everybody in the world is wrong. Oh yeah, she mutes it and talks to him for a while. Hold on. That you can I, I, It's funny, mankind has kind in their word. It should be man, let's fuck everyone el <laughs> else up. That's what oh mankind God. should actually be called. Is man, let's fuck everyone else up. It should, kind it's should though, not even everyone. be in mankind. Because man and kindness is, is, is totally opposite spectrums. People can't be kind. You know how many chances I've given people to be kind, and they choose not to be kind. They Where is she to be got, heartless like, I, monsters. She's I don't delusional. remember anyone saying, I'm going to be kind to Shani. Well, I'll tell you this. Oh, Lord. I'll tell you this. I have been nothing but kind. Wow. Too kind, I think, to people. Too kind, wow. she says. Too kind. Man, if I was such a ruthless fucking bitch. Then what? You guys like to say I'm a ruthless you give your bitch, kids but up? you have never <laughs> seen me ruthless. Bitch, get the fuck out of here. 
She's the victim. Because I'm fucking intelligent. I'm more intelligent than most people in this fucking world. She's more intelligent than most people in this world. Uh, you heard it here, folks. I'm an intelligent thinker. I think out of the box. So if I was actually ruthless... What? Oh, the things I could think up to fuck with someone. <laughs> Pyro says, I picture Shani flying like Superman. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to take some effort to get her off the that ground. Would be, but... That would be difficult. Thank you, Pyro, <laughs> for the super chat. Shani's such a smart outside the so box So you people thinker. out here are very, very, very lucky. I am kind. I am patient, patient, and I give mercy and grace. You're very, 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 very lucky that I have that in my personality. Right. Because if yeah. I didn't have that in my personality... Then what? Let's say whatever you did to me, and whatever you've ever tried to do to me... And then it ends there. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. I guess we're going to take a little break. Um, I don't know if she'll come back on. She said she's going to. Whether or not that actually happens will be another story. But um, I'm going to get off here. I'm going to take a break, get something to eat, and chill out for a little while. And uh, when she goes back live, I will be back and bring it to you guys. What would you guys think of the trivia? You think that's something we should do? Yeah. Often? Did you guys like that? Oh, we got a super chat. Uh, Buck says, this is why I always, I, I will always be single. No woman will ever be able to live up to the ex expectations of womanhood. Shani sets on a daily basis. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Thank you, Buck, for the super chat. I appreciate that. <laughs> did you guys enjoy the, um, the trivia thing that we did? Maybe we'll do some more of that, especially during her streams where she's just uh, playing games, video games, and shit. I know, because it's so boring. That was very boring, but at any rate, <clears throat> I had a good time doing did it. You, did you just call me boring? No, I said she was boring. What so she was doing, playing video games, was boring. She's better at video games than me? What video games? What are you even talking about? Are you saying I'm stupid? Yes. I am oh, saying uh, that. You're stupid now. I'm, I'm stupid? Very stupid. I can't believe you would say that. Okay. And you're not funny. So now I'm not funny and I'm stu I'm stupid and not funny. Yep. Oh my That's gosh. That's what I'm telling you. That's what I'm telling you, so shut the fuck up. Anyway. Oh <laughs> if I anyway. On. Um I uh like I said, I will be back. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And um, I'm going to leave you with a little song like I do. And I will see you guys probably in a little while. So see you then. Bye, guys. Bye, babe. Love you, babe.
I'm better, but that's all I can give you right now. I apologize. COVID has ruined a, a singer's lungs, folks. Not even CeeLo can sing like he used to. It sucks. I hate COVID. Do you?